Um, testing, testing, one, two, three, testing, testing, whoop at me, testing, testing, five, six, nine, testing, testing, none of you saw anything. Okay, I think I'm done breaking things. Hey, good evening! Uh, how you all doing today? I am breaking stuff and undulating and everything as well. Uh. So I'm gonna talk about the reset stream? What reset stream? Hey, Niche! Thank you for the 18 month resub! I appreciate it. Thank you kindly. Consider keeping the dragons alive. Depends. Entirely depends. <laughs> ah. Crack my everything. There, there, exactly. There was no reset. You're breaking things again. I am doing... Th I, I am a professional streamer who makes no mistakes and definitely doesn't accidentally input the wrong thing causing my OBS to literally burst into fucking flames. 
I, I, that would never happen. Absolutely not. Well, he quests after six dragons, but questing after a whole eleven of them. Oh. Oh, man. For the record, this is a continuation of the last time we played, which was... Oh god, almost, almost... Go almost two months, like a month and a half. I actually wanted to stream uh, this near the beginning of the month, but... I will be 100% transparent that when Akira Toriyama passed away, I couldn't even look at the game. <laughs> I couldn't even... I couldn't even look at the damn thing. Oh, man. This is this a new intro screen? Yeah, I thought it could be a fun idea. I thought it could be a nice idea. Hey, Floatak and Doll, thank you for the 13 month resub. Hey, thank you, thank you, thank you. I can't, I can't quit, you. I appreciate it. No, but no, you just streams, Pablo. I suspect that they're in respect to fall. All right, I'll take it. Hey, thank you. I appreciate it. Shooting star, welcome to the No Patrol. We vibe, generally. Oh, man. Okay, thank- I- every, everyone's- <laughs> So when I started the stream, I had, like, the mic setting incorrectly. And when I tried, like, reapplying it, it caught OBS on fire, and I had to, like, do a really quick reset. And everyone's like, what about my watch streak? What if it breaks? And I'm sitting here thinking, oh my god, I did not just fuck up that- <laughs> I was thinking, oh god, I did not just fuck up that bad, did I? <laughs> Everyone would have grabbed the lemon pulled at that point. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh man. Well, you know, uh, well, you know Akira Toriyama, uh, he, he's been fairly hands-off of Dragon Ball for a hot minute, and Dragon Quest... Uh, the art style is base, based on his designs, so... Most likely, they're both going to continue. Uh, though, uh, granted, he was going to not put his fingers into, uh... Uh, Dragon Ball Magic, or, uh, Daimo... Daimo? Daima? Forgot what it was... Forgot what it's called coming up. But he wound up getting... He wound up getting too invested. And now it will have, uh, story adjustments by him, so I... <laughs> Though I never watched Dragon Ball. Oh, it's good. You should. Good series. Very, very good series. I got a candle for my room. Uh, I have I've never had a candle before because I don't have a sense of smell, but... I hear they're just, like, good for you, period. So... I'm hoping... You know, it... It functions and 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 improves my well-being to some degree. We got a new starting page. Yeah, I thought it'd be cute. Everyone asked like, "Hey, why don't you do like a little showcase for the art thing?" And I got it working. I don't alarm you, but there's a slime clinging to your tail. Oh, don't worry. I'm luring it in. Oh man. Candles are pretty calming in general. Yeah, and it's like one of those ones that uh that melts without a uh without a flame kind of thing. Fox three minutes slow in two hours. Listen. Listen, it's a clock. Oh man. Hope your mental health is Oh, I'm I'm doing fine. I'm doing fine. If if you're wondering about like my uh my grandfather, everything that's going on with that. Uh, well, I don't have any, like, serious updates that I don't want to talk too much about my family's personal life, but he is being well taken care of, and as is my grandma. And I'll just leave it at that. But for the time being, it's alright. In fact, some days, his memory's fine, and I don't get it. <laughs> Some days his memory is perfectly fine and he addresses everybody fine and it's all right. I, I really don't understand. I don't think I ever will. Oh man, but it's it's going better. It's going better. Ah, wanna say hey? Good evening, dog. How you doing? Good evening. Good evening. Oh my. But yeah, I thought it could be a fun time. 
to finally get back to Dragon Quest. And, oh god, let me try and... Let me try and recap what in the devil's even going on in that game. Okay, so... Everything that has happened in Dragon Quest VI so far, so the game starts... With your party of three... Going to fight the final boss. But then all three of them are killed, and the main character then wakes up, and it's implied that he was sent back in time... But has no memory of his previous adventure, so... Now you're going through the world and trying to get back those friends that you made in that previous life. But also, there's two worlds going on. There's one world where everybody is kind of like a phantom, or the main characters are. And then there's a second world where they're tangible. And I... It, it's a little confusing. I don't really know what's going on yet. Oh, man. It's... I... I... Don't really have a gist of what's happening, but that's where we are. And we just got the three main characters back together, and they're about to board a boat somewhere. That's everything I remember from Dragon Quest VI so far. It's a weird one. It's a weird one, but I'm into it so far. Oh man, is that Goku in the in the far back over there? Yeah, <laughs> no, they haven't explained the two worlds yet. No, I'm curious though. Like, like what what's the title of the dang game again? It's like realms realms of revelation or something. So it's got something to do with multiple worlds. I just don't know what yet. Oh man. Is this from Adventures of Die? Yes. Yes, it is. Oh, man. I will say, I will say tonight, I have a little bit of a migraine, so I'm not going to be using my VTube rig. So, I'm, uh... <laughs> I'm not going to use the hyena tonight, purely because... When I use my rig, I have a big light on me the entire time, and I'm just going to... Turn that off and fold it back instead <laughs> for tonight. Oh man, Ub Ub Rally? Oh yeah, what's that? Oh, there we go. You should probably, you know, reconnect my controller. No Yin Dragon Quest, but no Yin equivalent exchange. <laughs> yes, equivalent exchange. Alas, no hyena. Alas, there is no Yin on this day. Okay, now let me move this over here. Dragon Quest Star and Dragon Ball? Oh yeah, he, he's actually had a... Akira Toriyama hasn't actually drawn for Dragon Ball in about... Oh... <clears throat> I believe nine years now. He's actually had a protege he's been training ever since in the event of him passing and because his hands started kind of going out. You know, he started getting really bad arthritis. So his protege, I think uh, his name is Toyotaro, has been drawing for him since. So if you're wondering about, uh, you know, the, the state of, like, you know, the art of the things that he worked on, Toyotaro is probably going to be the one to work on those. If you've read the Dragon Ball manga at all, uh, you'll recognize Toyotaro's work. He did do super. Toyotaro did. Hey, Odaiko Live. Thank you very much for the raid. Good evening. I knew I was forgetting something on this damn screen. It was the alerts. God damn it. Of course it was the alerts. Oh, I don't even have the chat on screen. Oh, I just realized. Oh, I'm a failure. <laughs> God damn it. You know what? It looks feng shui as fuck. Fun, 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 fun looks nice. It's such a mess. I failed. We'll forgive you. Yeah, there's a mushroom on your shirt. I'm a failure. <laughs> I 
always think of uh, Francine from Arthur every time I fuck something up. The way that she looks down there, so she goes, Oh, I'm a failure! <laughs> like, she's like surprised, it's so funny. Oh my god. Hey! <laughs> oh god. Range, you be in bear mood? I see. So, I'm gonna break things. I'm gonna break things on my end, if you don't mind me. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Move that, let me, oh! Let me break that. Fantastic, fantastic, that, that, yeah, just get rid of that. Okay, all right. Okay, all is well. All is good. I... I'm going to get the stream started. How far am I on Freyrin? Or Fr Freyrin, damn it. It's it's such an annoying name. <laughs> uh, how far am I on Freyrin? Um... Uh... Oh god. Uh, where am I at that I can say without spoilers? Um... Without spoiling anything, their party of three just became a party of four. That's where I just got off at. I, I was at the episode where... <laughs> where she tried using her, uh, her sex appeal to the guy to recruit him. And she just goes, Mwah, and smooches that little heart out. <laughs> Maybe I'm just too mature for you, Sonny. Somebody get this child out of here. God. No, Freeon is absolutely fucking funny. Oh my god. <laughs> Somebody get this child out of here. Jesus Christ. The way she started trying to talk like an old lady because he said he was into older women. God, the whole thing. I'm just... It's, it's so good. It's such a good anime. Oh my god. Okay, let me do this. Yeah, that part. That's exactly where I was at. Oh, man. Hello, good evening. He says that Freyrin is an old lady, not an old lady. <laughs> because she's like, what a... She's like over a thousand? She's like, what, a thousand fifty or something like that? Good God. Oh, man. All right. Let's see here. Let me do this. Let me do that. And restart this. Don't break it. 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 All right. Fantastic. Am I good? Am I good? Is it good? Do I hear the thing? Oh, it's loud as fuck! Okay, I can go over to this screen now. Hi, I'm gonna be an otter today. <laughs> because my other one broke. <laughs> oh, man. Whammy, no whammy. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah, yeah. Twink! Like, Twink, at least a twunk, right? Nope. At least. You're breaking more things? <laughs> says... What, what do I even have for that binding? I, these, are, these are all bindings I'm not familiar with. I move things around too much. It says right here you're a bitch. There we go. Okay. What kind of twinks have I... Exactly! Exactly. What kind of twinks have packs like these? Exactly! Okay, yeah, so, um... Yeah, it it broke, so I'm using a PNG tuber today. So I thought I'd use this because I've never I've only gotten to use once, and I plan to use this for like DS games. It's uh, d d d yeah, you know what Yeah, exactly. We get the ditto. Okay, go to your room. <laughs> so Dragon Quest. I have vague idea of where the fuck I even am in this thing. Vague, vague idea of where the fuck I am in this thing. Calzone, right? 
Right, Calzone. That was the name. Okay. Right. I feel like I must purchase something while listening to this music. It did, you know, it does, it does kind of sound like a shopping channel, actually, doesn't it? Oh, there's a white? Yeah, you know, the sprites, you know, I tried to get the scaling correct. You know, I tried to get it to where it was an accurate representation of, you know, how it would be on the DS. You know, there was the PS1 version, but, um... There was, there was the SNES version, but that wasn't happening. It, the, the translation's there, but... Yeah, there's some bugs and stuff, and I'm like, you know, fuck it, I'll just do the, uh... I'll just do the DS version instead. Okay, where do I go? In this hellhole. Probably like check my gear. Try and figure out where I am. Yeah, yeah, Katzen? Yeah? <laughs> that what you wanna go with? Let's see. Boomerang. Iron claw, leather kill. Right. Oh right. She's bad. She's like level five, isn't she? Yeah. Right. Okay. Been a while since I use this one? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. I only used this back um, when I was doing uh, Pokemon Black, but then... <laughs> I wound up not continuing it because I'm uh, I'm horrible at doing so. Chain Sickle. Does that... Does that actually do, like, AoE or anything? It's 1,100. Na Naster? Eh? This book reading frames is the last the new since you the last time you used this one. There's a few new ones. Uh, let's see. Can I get anything better for you? I get things better for a lot of people, actually. Millie, surprisingly, is better armor than everyone else in the group. She has the highest defense at level 5? Are you serious? I'm just kind of surprised. Alright. Let's give this to Carver. Okay. There we go. BNG has two Pokeballs on him. D what is the implication for that? Jesus Christ. Does that have a chapter on uh, on what? On what? No, you wanna you wanna say it out loud for the class? Uh yeah, let's give this to Carver, sure. Sickles are single target, right? I'm thinking of whips that are. Okay. No, right, all right. I. Yeah. That, I, don't, I don't know how there's so much thirst. Uh, we're under the fucking water. I even have it in the background here. Just saying. Right. I'll read the whole damn to you better fucking not. <laughs> you want to be riding the ferry by you take from the ticket counter over there. Yeah, okay. Whatever you say, Jesus. This is the ferry ticket counter. Single ferry to Somnia costs 50 gold coins. Yeah. I probably should have leveled her up. I didn't do that. Let's take a look around town a bit to pass the time. Okay. Yeah, sure, whatever you say. No, lord. <laughs> except whips go across the screen doing less damage except one specific whip. Auto sees? <laughs> you, you, you know, to be honest, you know, I just... I just kind of really like Buizel. And I was like, yeah, sure, yeah, sure, why not? I like Buizel. I think it'd be a good idea. I think, I think it'd be a good idea. Should I just ask around? I ain't seen your face around here before. Travelers only. you. What, you looking for Rosmere on the orders of the King of Somnia? But it's been an age and a day since the King. Oh, cranky. I said a bit too much there anyway. Bon voyage, yeah? Yeah! Ella, come give your old granddad a hug. Must have been dreaming again. I didn't see you there, Traveler Zarya. I gotta apologize, ever since my granddaughter left this town, I've lost my lust for life. If you ever bump into my Ella on your travels, give her a message from me, will ya? Don't have to worry about her old granddad, tell her to concentrate on finding her own happiness. Okay. And the Buizel has <laughs> massive 
It's not that big. It's not, it's not that. It's not that big. I don't think. Uh, but it's a little big. <laughs> Weasel jump scare literally yelped. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Of course, is my mom knows everything. Right. <laughs> Who do I even talk to here? It's covering a good part of the screen. I am locked in a contained hell. I cannot expand to the top of the left of this screen. Have you ever, have you ever told a lie? Sure. Oh no, you know if you tell a lie, should I anything? Well, Rosmere will see right through you. My grandma told me. Apparently, Rosmere was made by the great goddess herself many an age ago. They say it exists somewhere in this world, but its exact location's a mystery. Why is your Blues' lower tough so <laughs> that it looks like a boat? That one. That was. <laughs> That's not the intention of that. It's just because, you know, if you have it be smooth down there, it looks worse. The Ghost Stories tub is on Amazon Prime. Oh, no. Hey, you. Uh, what can I do for you? My husband's a bit... Carver, you've come back. Thank the goddess. Dear, come here. It's Carver. Oh. Oh, is this his family? Oh, shit. Wake up, dear. Carver's come back. My boy's come home. It only makes a... a, a Okay, okay, listen, listen, my intention wasn't to be... Listen, I just like Weasel. <laughs> I just... Yeah, I, I, I didn't think... Yeah, it was, it was that horny, you know. Hey, you awake? Oh, for goddess sake, Carver's back for the first time in Asian. You're dead to the world and dribbling like a baby. Carver, come and wake him up. Your dad will be so happy to see you. Easy there, I'm sorry, lady, but be thinking of a different Carver. Oh, Carver, stop fooling around. You think a mother would have known her own flesh and blood and everything like that? Look, I don't know this house. I've never lived in any house. We martial artists are so intense, we live in tents. Can I have a word with the localizers? <laughs> we better make a break for it, Calzone. This lady's bonkers. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Carver, my boy, what happened to you? Are you my son? No, Robin Blind. Was that a pun? See, that's weird because it does look like it would be his house, right? Because of all the carpentry tools. And the fact that Carver's a carpenter. Creative, yeah, creative, creative carvings carpentry. We saw it all. Always happy to see. Well, well I can say one thing. Uh, yeah, I'm glad you like it. <laughs> Have we met somewhere before? I suppose not. Sorry, it's probably my famously overactive imagination. Just to feel like the first time I've spoken to you. Yeah. How about the maid? Sure about the maid job, are you? But Ella, you won't find that cold-hearted witch haunting this town any longer. Just the thought of what she did to my dear Mr. Barkington. I forgot the fucking dog's name. <laughs> Mr. Barkington makes me all queasy. When she harmed Mr. Barkington, she harmed me too. Why are you looking at me like that? Do you have something to say? I'm a very busy man. Ride the dog. Okay, so the last time we played, this dog got poisoned by a lady who was trying to frame the maid. Are you trying to tell me that Ella's not the culprit? Yes. How could you possibly know that? Did you witness the fiendish deed yourself? Yes. Ivy, the innkeeper's child. Well, there's no doubt that Ivy smitten with my son, which would give her a motive. <clears throat> well, even if what you say is true, I fear you've spoken too late. By sheer coincidence, there was a traveling merchant in town who was looking for an assistant. I sent Ella off with him in a pit of pike. Fit of pike. I couldn't stand the thought of a dog-hating maid being anywhere than a league of me. You did what to her? I've heard that the traveling merchant trade is extremely dangerous. There's no telling what fate is in store for- You sold her?! Jesus Christ. If what you say is true, then that girl suffered a grave injustice of my hands. 
Jesus Christ, dude! Well, I'm sure you wouldn't concoct such a story for a common maid's sake, but it would have been nice if you told me earlier. I'm afraid there's nothing I could do now after the fact. Wow! Okay. Yeah, like, peaked my- yeah, it's a weird word. Okay. <clears throat> right. Uh, but now what? Hmm. I guess I'll just keep an eye out for her. It's forced assistance. The mayor admitting the selling us would be quite a scandal. Uh, yeah? Afraid she's not quite ready to sail yet. Let's take a look around town for a bit. Okay, sure. Whatever you say. Hey, CD, thank you for following. Welcome to the Knoll Patrol. I hope you enjoy your stay here. Thank you, thank you. I already talked to this guy. Well, that's something, but your boys will distract me. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm shocked he seems to believe you. I guess we described it pretty well. Dillsman's been shot of his former self since Elle went away to write tragedy. He spends his day staring at the sea. I'm just hoping he doesn't go completely loopy. Ah, oh, shot. Great, you ruined a family and sold a woman into a slave trade. Fantastic, dude. The mayor's looking for a new maid, but I don't think he'll have any tears. I wonder what happened to Elle looking up when Windu Manor and Millennium will it. Right. Didn't they- didn't he say the innkeeper's daughter? Welcome to our inn, our rate is 45 gold per night. You. Oh great, this is just my luck. I knew the old mayor would lose his rag, but I didn't think he'd run the girl out of town. I never met for things to go this far. Oh, customers, welcome! Don't pay attention to my blabbering. Yeah. Oh my god. It was just a, it was just me trying to kill a dog. Yeah, I mean, like, why, why are you so upset? God. Okay. Uh, right. Is there something I need to do inside the, um... Okay. Better get me all this cargo, the ship will be sailing soon. the top to an ear. Can we throw her off the pier? Thinking about it. Uh, run, is that fair last with ye? Well, blow me down, you're a lucky bunch. Should like to take Gallic down to the high seas one day. <laughs> hey, you. Whatever she says, pay no heed. Her tongue's a bit too big for her mouth, that's all. Hey. And of her sunny we were, but we decided to call the trip off. This is a bit dangerous these days. We'll have the king in that state thinks of Murdala's curse. Shut your trap, woman. I told you not to talk about that. Loose lips sink ships. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, this town seems lovely. Or that king of Somnia was secretly investigating the dread femur down. What if that's why that happened to him? I'm bound to learn more until we get to Somnia. He's saying she looks like a sailor. Yeah? Are you not from around here? I suppose that means you haven't heard of the lone swordsman, have you? I was walking along in the forest when a horde of monsters attacked me, then out of nowhere, ploop, the lone swordsman came to my rescue. What does that sound? It happened in the forest to the east of here. He saved other travelers too, I heard. After he walked the monsters, he started off without even giving his name. They were well heroic. Donna, Donna. We're all more than familiar with your lone swordsman stories. So how about it cracking on with a bit of work, eh? Is the virus from the mo 5 movie? No. <clears throat> no. 
Good day to use the ferry ticket counter. Single fare costs 50 coin. Wait. Did I already buy the fare? Am I crazy? I buy another fare? Right. What else is there to look around and down for? Don't have to worry about her old granddad. Tell her to concentrate on finding her own happiness. Okay. Sure. Have you seen the Dragon Quest V movie? Yeah, we all watched it together. Um. Well. Okay, it, it's a great movie if you know what. Well, okay. Um. Okay, so Dragon Quest V, the movie, it's interesting in how it is mostly faithful, but it's not that it's not faithful, it's almost really faithful in the sense that it doesn't explain anything. Like, nothing is explained in, Dr in Dragon Quest V movie. Nothing is explained uh, at any point, and it's really funny. Because if, you, if you've never watched Dragon Quest, if you never played Dragon Quest V, it won't make any sense. And there's a lot of weird admittances if you have played it, like the daughter not existing. <laughs> it's really funny. But, uh, it's basically like watching Dragon Quest V on, like, speed. It's going really fast, but then they spend a really long time with the Bianca Flora decision, which, don't get me wrong, that's a huge decision in game, but... They spend a really long time on it in the movie. It's like kind of weird. <laughs> and th that being said, the characterization's good. It's really good. Like Bianca's great, Flora's great, uh, the hero's great, everybody's great. It's just <laughs> it goes so fast. And then there's a twist that shows up in the last like five minutes of the movie. And it comes so out of nowhere. It's like getting hit by a train. And then it immediately shoves away the twist and pretends it didn't happen. It's so fucking weird. The pacing is a bullet train, yeah. <laughs> that's a pretty good... That's a pretty good explanation, yeah. The pacing is a bullet train. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's like a solid 10 minutes just for the decision. It, yeah, it's weird. Hey, Red, good evening. No daughter- Oh yeah, the protag isn't royalty. Henry never marries. But like, I can't even say I didn't like it. I really enjoyed it. But that twist is so fucking bizarre, and it's so... <laughs> Again, it hits you like a freight train. Oh my god, it's really funny. Oh my god. But yeah, it's a weird one. Is there something I can do for you? What, you're saying Ella didn't fiddle with Mr. Barkington's dinner? I knew it. Such a pure-hearted girl would never commit such an act. She wouldn't hurt a fly, let alone a dog. Why'd I ever allow Papa to put doubt in my mind? I should have done something to help her. You've my eternal gratitude, whoever you are. Now there's no time to waste. I must get after her. You excuse me. By checking up on that candle, making sure a fire doesn't start. Lugan's able to make it. Hey, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hope you enjoy your time. If you knew I was innocent, why didn't you speak up? I'm sorry I'm hardly in a position to criticize you. I was equally complacent myself. I do apologize. You better go, but I must thank you again. You've given me a new lease on life. Hi, <laughs> right, bye, dude. Thank you! I just kind of really like Bleasles and was, and was like, Hey, I want a Sona for like Pokemon streams that I wanted to do that I wound up never committing to. <laughs> oh, Lord. I just like the Sona period, so I... Hey, good evening, D2D. Good evening. Well, the, the idea... Okay, 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 okay. To, ex to explain the twist in that movie, 
the idea was to like say like hey these games mean a lot to people and they grew up with them and and they're very important despite the world's not being real they're real to them i get it it's a sweet message but oh my god it's a freight train <laughs> it hits you so fast so fast you have, like, no time to actually comprehend it. Oh, man. Hey, there we go. You'd be the last passengers to arrive once you're on board. We'll be set in sail. You ready next stop? Cape Somnia. <laughs> All right. Hand me your ticket and on you get. It's executed really poorly and stupidly, but also hilarious at the same time. Yeah, like, I get the intention, and it's cute, and I understand it. It did not go over my head or anything. It's just, holy shit. <laughs> holy shit. I feel like the movie did that well enough. Yeah, they really didn't need to spell it out. <laughs> what, what fucked of me is when the fucking AI program holds up a cartridge of Dragon Quest V and calls it Dragon Quest V on the Super Famicom. I about fucking lost it. Our perilous voyage is at an end. The glimmering spires of Somnia await ye. <clears throat> oh my god. Hey, no job click. Thank you for the 38 month resub. What movie is this? Dragon Quest, your story. It's... It's fucking bizarre. <laughs> it's fucking weird. The next ship won't sail for another three days. Yeah, all right. The one on Netflix, yeah. You know, it's funny. It's actually animated really well too. It's it's really pretty. I journey far and wide to bring succor to the flock of the goddess. Okay, thank you for your succor. Oh man. Hey, Moral Cuz, thank you for following. Hope you enjoy your stay here. Welcome to the Null Patrol. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Eh, yeah, save your again. In the Spanish translation of Dragon Quest V, they named Bianca Bianca Adoptada, which Adoptada means adopted. <laughs> That's fucked up. Bianca's adopted? Yes. <laughs> That's fucked up. <laughs> that's... that's really funny, oh my god. I am but a humble fisherman, but I've learned a thing or two in my time. For instance, I know a traveler can find a way to Somnia Castle from here. Mount is strain lies to the west, simply travel around to the north and then head about further west. That's all there is to it. Am I spacing? Oh, no, uh, uh, definitely not, definitely not. No, spacing is very attractive. I'm sorry, yeah, it's me. Right. Did I ever set your thing? No. Uh, does it really matter for you right now? Probably not. Uh, she is going to spam every spell she has if I make her do that. Uh, fight wisely? Good luck, I guess. Oh, she does no damage. All right. Simply go around the nest. Thanks, wise fishman. I'll end word to animal. Oh. Okay, Spacey bites you. <laughs> You're not high enough level to bite me. The she slimes are defeated. Who's wisely and why are we having our party members fight them? I don't know. Seems like a dickhead. Hey, Alexander, thank you for the 40 month resub. Grazie, what the fuck is that? <laughs> I'm blaming you for my recent Dragon's Dogma addiction. Nice shiny Sveal Sona, by the way. <laughs> Grazie! Uh. Is that Toxie? Or is that Gui? Gui! Gui! That's some peace, you poor bastard. You killed Coco? No, that's his new username. That's what it was. It's... I still... 
I still haven't actually been in his stream too much since then. He always streams at weird hours where I'm not awake. Oh man. Co Coco something? Dude, dude, that really does just look like, uh... <laughs> it looks like, looks like Gui with a hat. Get him. All right. <laughs> Are you talking about? <laughs> it's really, this real sweetheart of a, uh, of a French streamer. <laughs> Coconut, you stop that. Kokori Cow, that's what it was. Kokori Cow. Oh man. Yay. Space to use water gun. I got this at Ross. Oh, I got Basil? Oh, that was, um. Millie, that's your name, right. Oh, right, uh, quick summary, seeing as it's been a month and a half. Uh, I am Hero. I do everything Hero does, obviously. Uh, Carver is like Sarevna. Sarevna Elena from Dragon Quest IV. Except he actually gets unique moves. I mean, that, that's pretty sick. And then there's, uh, Millie. I, I actually don't know what kind of mage she is. Uh, I think she's a healer, but she... No, I think she's just heal, isn't she? Uh... She's heal, uh, status effect, and buff. Alright. <coughs> right, okay. Sarevna means princess? That I actually don't know. You just got her at the end of the first stream, yes. Yeah, we just got her. She was the king's daughter, yes, and very, very good at punches. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> it's not like I'm against that kind of art. I'm just saying. Current DQ6 Prime members, Gogeta, Android 16, and Android 18. I... I fucking love the Pro Tags design in this game. G genuinely, I really like the cast designs in this one. Southeast to more. All right. Duh. This is when they start giving melee no magic characters other things to do than basic attacks. Right. Yeah, that's right. Zaro did have that in four, didn't he? Yeah. Do the emotions change on the wrong emotes? Oh! <laughs> I have these on toggles. So at any time, I can just read a book. What I do is um, I use a control with extra buttons uh, that I need to do because I have arthritis and it helps me, uh, you know, get around certain things, certain bindings to help out my hands a bit. So for all the extra buttons, uh, I have them set to do this. For instance, the control stick is not used because I'm playing a DS game, so up, down. <laughs> Triple is that? <clears throat> Pardon me. It's nice finally to say, wet my whistle. At my age, I probably should avoid the dangerous journeys like this. What's that you say? Where am I going? Let us just say I'm searching for the misplaced dream and leave it at that. But as you can see, this is just a boring old cave. Nothing here, am I wrong? If that's all, then I shall be bidding you the good day. Farewell. Okay. <laughs> yeah, sure. Boring old cave, whatever you say. <coughs> Man, I cannot stop coughing. Hey. A more Seco Essence has the power to restore HP. Is that a better healing item than, um... You know what, actually, hold on. Good god. Alright. Is that a better healing item than, uh, healing her?
Welcome to more home of Amor Seco Essence, except no substitute. I take you here to sample our famed Amor Seco Essence made from our peerlessly pure water. No. You're not? Well, you're missing out. Take a draught of Amor Seco Essence to cure what ails you. Okay. <laughs> Why a weasel for Dragon Quest? Eh. I'm really sorry you should have made a reservation in advance. What? Welcome to Rainbow's End Gold Bank. We don't have any gold of yourselves in the vault at the moment. We can be helping you. No. Okay. Oh, fair lady Seductra, will you ever be mine? My heart belongs to you. You didn't hear that, did you? No. The thing is, I fell head over heels in love, and now I can't focus on anything. When I heard that the water here can cure any sickness, I knew I had to give it a shot. But the truth is, there's no cure for the sickness called love. How will I ever live without her? All I can know is that I see her in my dreams. Is there any point to the banks? Uh, you lose half your money when you die. So they can be very helpful. Oh no, not again. Look at the state of me, upside down again. Even that sweet Amor Seco Essence has managed to stop me tossing and turning in my sleep. Huh. You just arrived in town. You must be looking for a place to lay your weary head. But I'm afraid you're not the only one. Zin often booked up well in advance. I have a of the innkeeper, though, also down to even have a broom cupboard for you to squeeze into. It's magical curing water that's said to cure any ailment, and they're selling it for 120 gold. Look at the armor shop. Ah, what do you got? Hang on, nice. Oh, that's not bad. Oh, that's really good. I got both of those. Give that to me. Okay. And give that to Carver. One of the healing water can also heal Ligma. <laughs> of all the monsters I've faced in my time, that old dragon working in the church is the fiercest. I just said I was looking for treasure and she ate a right go at me. You know, we bit my head off, she did. Seems to have some. Be in her bonnet about treasure hunters. I ate some with a passion, she does. Okay. Oh, man. Who drew my weasel PNG? Oh, that was, um... <laughs> I am not sitting here. Not off the top of my head. Oh, 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 oh. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Clint! Oh, thank you, T-Dub. <laughs> Clint! I've talked to Clint a handful of times. Thank you, T-Dub. Hey, you. We grew up drinking Amor's water, so we're bursting with rude health. What? What the fuck does that mean? What's that? I'm afraid you'll have to speak up. The cave you say? The roof collapsed years ago, so you won't get far going in there. What's that? You didn't ask me about that, you say? Forgive him. Forgive me of the sound of that waterfall. I can barely hear myself think half the time. <laughs> okay. Want to hear a riddle? Here goes. When is a bar not a bar? When your husband makes you pretend you're working at a bar for some bizarre reason. Oh. Do you have an idea how much sick I get for having a bunny girl for a mother? Jesus. <laughs> All a man truly needs to be happy is to be served a drink in his own home by his very own bunny girl. I'm in high spirits, you can tell, so I'll share some ancient wisdom with you. There's an old proverb that the people of the sound have known for generations. With mirror key in hand, objects in Moon Mirror Tower are closer than they appear. So this is just one big fetish roleplay. What luck! A file of a more seco essence. Okay. Why are they really weird about this water? Hmm. Some spice noodles, I ate them because I want to be warm, but now I'm cold, sweating, my mouth is tingling, and my stomach is churning. Brace for impact. 
Ah, uh, more tourists, just what we needed. Anyway, I suppose there's a cave north is in your guidebook? Sure. But won't be in your guidebook is the story of the mirror key that was once hidden in that cave. An earthquake some years ago brought down the cave's roof, sealing off whatever was inside it. I don't know if the story about the key is true, but it's too late to find out now. No Yin detected? What? He's right behind me. For now, the waters of Amor can run clear, but I live in fear of the day the Dread Fiend descends upon us. His sole desire seems to be to destroy all beauty and attain all purity. Okay. Whatever you say. When I was a wee nipper, I heard about a pair of love-struck bandits who came here in search of spoils to plunder. They ventured into the northern cave hunting for treasure, but none of them ever returned. Never returned. I can't begin to imagine what they encountered in that cave. All I know is that the bandit who did return put her thieving ways behind her and sailed in a more. I speak of Evgenia, the old woman who does odd jobs in the church. Now there's a woman with a past. Okay. Genshin Impact? Oh no, sweetie. Okay. Oh. Your visits to Morwell, I'm afraid that our church is currently being cleaned. You can't save here? You can't rest here? Oh, you can save here. Thanks. Well, there's here to kill you if you do or say anything cringe. <laughs> Alright. I look for your regular avatar instead of loaf. Nice. Sanguia could be saying that chicken enemy looks like him. <laughs> God. A silencing ram. God. A loaf is cringe, you can't help it. Nah, loaf's not cringe. I think. Wonder if I should have Millie be focused on healing, or maybe I should reserve that for later or something. Cheese slimes, yeah, they're the red ones, the orange ones, those things. Oh, Jesus. Uh... Wolf cosplays all fucking day, never stops, pretty crungo, man. Listen, it's his favorite thing to do. You know what- you know what being cringe is? Cringe is just being on it, being earnest, you know? To be cringe is to be free. So you know what? Let people be cringe. Eh? Jesus. That mannequin enemy is so creepy looking. Yeah, just a bit. The boy is a water gun. I'm starting feeling he's not a real boy. What? It's in the move list. How could you say that? All right. Who is that guy? Oh, that's Loaf. He's got very pointy hair. Here's some Loaf Krongo bucks. <laughs> well, thank you for the Loaf Krongo bucks. Thank you. Also, I need to move the chat box slightly to the left because it's like... Hold on, it's like slightly off and that's fucking with me a little bit. There we go, now you're a bit more mad. There we go. There we go, all right, fantastic. Chatbox gore. Chatbox gore? Please. I will not cringe. Cringe is the earnest killer. The little chill that heralds totally go deaf. I will not resist cringe, I shall let it wash over me and then it's gone, only I will remain- Jesus Christ. Alright! Evening! Hey, good evening. Millie gained a level evac. Oh, man. Is, is there like a path up here? Okay. <laughs> it's that chicken. Hmm. 
Bridge the powerhouse of the cell, please. Real beer with fire water from the red. I hate that image so much. <laughs> oh god. Okay. What do you have to say? Welcome to Somnia, a city of class and distinction. Let's try to keep it that way, shall we? Oh no, it's a gated community. So like an inn around here? Oh, there we go. Hi. Yes, please and thank you. Good morning, Trish. You had a restful sleep. To the King Magnum TikTok. Yes, I have. Weapon shop. Ooh, upgraded boomerang. I am fucking broke. What do you got? Noble Garb Bronze Armor. This does nothing. Dancer's Costume, Bronze Shield. Alright. Again. Still broke. I know we're at war of Mordon's forces, but who ends up paying for everything? The taxpayer, that's who. We're being squeezed dry, I tell you. Now they want another 50 gold coins out of each of us? Honestly. When our king and queen were healthy, we never tax like this. Something seriously awry. I mean, just gotta survive one enemy encounter. I know they're demons right out of the underworld, but, you know, that's not that bad. I take you're familiar with Mordon, that dread feet and all his dark deeds? Sure. Of course you are, only an ignoramus wouldn't be. Let me outline a humble theory of my own. I don't believe our king and queen are really ill. I believe they've been cursed by Mordal. There's no stopping him. Who knows what his next victim could be? It could be you! Or it could even be me! <laughs> I just wish he got striped by lightning in that moment. Have you heard? Our brave prince will have to bash monsters and defend Somnium. No one's seen or heard from him since. Hope he didn't get gobbled up by a monster. This is Somnia Castle, don't you know? We can't go allowing any riffraff to drift in and out. Why don't you go make a nuisance of yourself somewhere else? Fucking rude. <laughs> Fucking rude. Glambering down a well to get to another world? Never heard of such nonsense in my entire life. I don't know, I guess. Oh. Oh. Oh! Drackle. <gasps> oh! Oh! <laughs> okay. Oh! Let me just not. Oh. Yeah, that went well. Everyone's not revived, are they? Oh, they don't offer revival services! <gasps> oh, they don't offer revival services! Okay. Are these the things that ate the prince? Probably. Boomerang, go! Oh no, I can't cast magic. Whatever shall I do? Boomerang, go! Alright. Uh, hey, I don't think they offer revival services. Oh yeah? Oh yeah? Really? What gave that away? It shouldn't be too bad getting back to town, at least. Oh god. Once again, the church is making bank off of space he's need to revive his party. You know, that's yeah, happy in this bitch of a world. At least they aren't merging. Does game have a job system or choosing? Oh, I don't know. 
I don't know yet. <sighs> okay. Yeah, apparently they'll release a trail for the second Rebel Moon movie. What the fuck is Rebel Moon? Rude? Please. Alright. I know I have medicinal herbs. And then a more seco essence. Okay. Oh, I bought those. Ugh. If it does mean every third Dragon Quest games have job system. Yeah. Are you a Blizzle so cute? Thank you. I'm glad you like it. I like I like Blizzles. I, I I think they're neat. I've always liked them uh, ever since I was a kid. In fact, uh, <laughs> embarrassing, slightly embarrassing thing. Okay, I guess not really that embarrassing. Cause I'm pretty sure everyone did that at some point. I tried making a uh, I tried making like a game review when I was really young, and I had a Blizzle avatar. Have you ever played Final Fantasy A2 Tactics? Uh, yes, but not for more than, like, two hours. So, not really. 130 gold! Oh, all of you suck! You know, the goddess could, like, you know, offer me a discount? Maybe a punch card? Okay. You didn't like it? No, it was just kind of a weird period, I guess. Inoculally, she slimes are both genders. They were just called she slimes based by research. We assumed they had to be female based on the color differentiation. Nice. You know, I'm gonna save here, in case I eat shit again, and I can just come here. Oh man, one second as well. One second! There we go. But yeah, uh, when I was, uh, when I was younger I was doing a, uh... <laughs> I was making a... Uh... A review on um, Cave Story uh, Dokutsu Managatari uh, back when uh, there was like a kind of like jank Italian translation and I had a little Bleasel avatar and I made him look like quote <laughs> ages ago Spacey a Bleasel? Maybe Okay Alright It's like Cave Story. <laughs> All right. Let me... Back to Cave Story? Oh yeah, I grew up with it. Absolutely adore Cave Story. Bubble, bubble, bubble. How many times have Dragon Quest 1 to current? Oh, how many times have I paid the church to revive me? Well, thankfully in Dragon Quest 1, you don't have to worry about that, because the king revives you. And he's like, ah, you know what, I'll, I'll revive you this time, but you gotta stop doing this shit. Oh. The yeah, reason why I decided to use the Bleasel avatar today is I, I have a bit of a migraine, so I thought it'd be a nice idea to, like, not have the light on my face. And was like, hey, I'll use a PNG tuber instead. So the PNG Jank Street Secret Murder Night, you said the Charmer Love Virtually with Absolute Sameness. Man, ain't that a bitch. 
Cave Story stream when? Uh, I actually streamed it, uh, about like a year and a half ago. Um, I love Cave Story. Um, I will not play it again without a turbo button. <laughs> Never again without a turbo button, which I have now, so... I don't know, maybe I will. There's actually a uh, Cave Story fan remake that came out. Uh, that finally got, like, into, like, a finalized state and they're adding more content to it. That I really want to play. And I might do a stream about it relatively soonish. Wow. 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 Can you say what? Oh, does the king say that every time? Yes, every time. Quotes at? It's like a red cap. The, hen the king had just returned from bravely battling monsters when he was cruelly struck down. He fell into a deep slumber along with his queen, two of them were lost to the world. Who knows when they'll awaken? Oh, the kingdom's a sadder, colder place without their smiling faces. Oh. <laughs> no, I'll be fine, Andy. See, see, what one thing about my room is I keep it very dim. My monitor is actually very dim as well. Uh, the light has to be brighter so it can capture my facial expressions, so... Ah! Uh, it's very easy on me right now, and I've already taken my medicine, so no worries. <laughs> the green antenna. They are a part of his head, but they are cute. And they do kind of, like, make the look, don't they? This book entitled A Slime Story Part 3. My name is Uzo. My dream for the name to drip from the lips of... My dream is for this name to drip from the lips of all the people of the world. Y yeah? When people hear the dread name of Uzo, they'll shiver like sh they'll shiver like slimes in an avalanche. But Uzo's mewling interrupts my reverie. A cat? A mangy mug of no name or fixed abode? Well, my first task is clear. I shall battle this nameless cat to be my name known throughout this village. Oh my god, you killed a cat? Holy shit, dude. Oh, man. You folks seem well-traveled. Have you heard the rumors concerning King Samness? Yeah. Well, we've heard it all before. I have nothing to add. Come on. Okay. Okay, fine. Tell me. Rumor has the King Queen have been in the grip of a serious illness for more than a year. But this no ordinary illness, no, it seems they're in a deep sleep from which they cannot be roused. While the King and Queen slumber unawares, their son, the Prince, disappeared without trace. Truly, tragedy haunts this land. Can the fair kingdom of Somnia survive much longer? Oh, I don't know, man. Why don't you do something about it? Stab somebody. There's a minigame that can be played with a stylus. Nope. Adios. Come closer, I say there's something remarkably familiar about you. My mind's not as sharp as once, but I see we've met before. Perhaps I'm just rambling. His best days to be behind him, but in his youth, my husband was a strapping castle guard. He used to play with the young prince every day. Oh, it was a more innocent age. Oh, so I look like the prince. Wait a minute. Go sell some things. That uh, here. Take the scale armor. Uh, I guess I'll keep that. Sell the iron claw. All right. Noble garb. I wonder. We have a vintage Pokedex. It's very informative. Okay. My ah, <laughs> my liege, can this be true? Do my eyes deceive me? Is it really you? Are you the Prince of Somnia? Sure. My liege, it is you. Oh, we've waited so long for your return. Welcome back to your home. This is truly a day for rejoicing. 
you booked a for one shopping. Thank you. A whoop cell? I mean, don't tell everybody. <laughs> hey again. Can it be? <laughs> hey, it's me, your dead son. My liege, you've returned. You still remember me. I take it you're trusty ca Captain Rusty. I named you Rusty. I always knew you would return despite all the rumors that you had met a grisly end. You must let everyone in the castle know that you're back. Oh, what a joy. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Whatever you say. Hey, uh, anybody here got any, uh, got any good loot? By any chance? Oh, man. What you got around here? Oh, hey. My leech, please forgive me. I have expressed words from Chancellor Keating not to let anyone to pass no matter their status. Sure, Chancellor Keating did not foresee your return, but still orders are orders. I'm certain that the Chancellor will soon return. I humbly request you await his arrival. Okay. This is the other realm, right? Or did I miss some see if you being discovered to be Prince? Uh, this is the other realm. We got this to bloom. Oh! I believe this is the other realm. So you finally decided to return, have you? Everyone here has been worried sick, you know? I'd give anything to see the look on Chancellor King's face when he finds out you're back. My liege, I'll unless you return, wait till I tell the others. Yeah, okay. Hey, Esoteric Pumpkin, thank you for the raid. Also, hey, good morning, Caustic. How you doing? No, oh, let's see. Hot Tub Club? Hey! Good evening, good evening. Even the prince prisoner was happy to see you. I'm just that charismatic, I guess. Oh, let's see. Door is locked, doesn't like any of the keys in our prize possession. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good day, good morning, good morning. Where everything's going well on your end, I am the weasel otter adjacent tonight. You Mr. The Prince, really? Really, really, really? We used to play together all the time, didn't we, Princey Wincy? You remember, don't you? But there's something different about you. I don't think you're my Princey Wincy at all. You can't fool me. No one will believe you. The Buizel questing for dragons. <laughs> oh, yeah? Oh, right. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, hey again. Oh! My leash, please forgive me. I have expressed words from Chancellor Key not to allow anyone to pass them another status. Yeah, 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 yeah. One, the name of the goddess are you wittering on about, man? Oh, hey, Rusty. She knows too much, and her? God! Captain Rusty. Dragonite shape, boy. <laughs> Listen. Prince is free to roam whenever he pleases, wherever he pleases, without being impeded by a mere underling. But Chancellor Keating told me. And if Chancellor Keating told you to eat a slime, I suppose you'd do that too. I assume full responsibility for this. You're free to proceed, my liege. Your parents are upstairs. Damn. Hey, my lovely mom and dad. Hey, you got, you got stuff? Nice. This is a very tired reflection looking back at him. He's had a bit of a time. Just a bit. Da -da 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 -da. Dun, boom, boom, boom. Do -do -do. The behind the thing. Looney, you got priorities? Damn straight. And we got anything to say? Alright. Uh, Millie, can you use this? Uh, I really have no idea what the fuck style is, but... 
Yeah, okay. My heart breaks to see them unable to wake, trapped in the deepest slumber. The king is sound, but the queen often mumbles in her sleep. She seems anxious to acquire a mirror. Only our elegant queen can be concerned about her appearance even as she sleeps. Oh. The queen appears to be sleeping dimply. She seems to be mumbling something in her sleep. The mirror. If only we had the mirror. Oh. He appears to be sleeping deeply. His breathing is soft and steady. That sucks. Oh my. Okay. We do that. Yin? Oh. <laughs> With the, the, the mirror and the one? Yin? Oh yeah? Hi. I think the style is four spacey. I don't know. Hey. So you've returned. The news is somewhat unexpected, I must confess. Of course, I'm overjoyed. It's been a terrible burn to govern in the kingdom in your absence. But allow me to gaze at your princely visage. Forgive me, but is there not something amiss here? What do you mean? What could be amiss? Is undoubtedly the prince of our fair kingdom. Captain, I don't doubt your sincere conviction, but listen to this interesting tidbit I heard just now. A certain shabbily dressed young man is said to have purchased a suit of noble garb earlier on today. <gasps> Buongiorno, furry Milo. Hope you're doing well. I sincerely want to believe this is the real prince, but we can't afford to take no chances. But. Allow me to pose one simple question to prove whether or not this is the prince. If you are indeed the prince of this realm, then the little teaser should not present the slightest problem. You're perhaps aware the prince had a cherished sister who died tragically young. Tell me, prince, what was that sister's name? Uh... <laughs> um... Vanessa? My leash! Everyone heard that I trust? It's clear this is not the prince of this or any other realm. A... a, a weasel? Uh, yeah, yeah, I wasn't using my rig tonight, so I was like, yeah, sure, I'll do something different tonight, why not? Hey, uh, you was, I was going to plan this for, like, Pokemon stuff, but I wound up not doing it, so, uh... Yeah. Come on, Rust, Captain Rusty, I hold you personally responsible for this unforgivable breach of castle security. Guard sees these feeble frauds at once. God. Alright. <laughs> I mean, hey, yeah, Weasel's cute, so you know, I can see it. Are you actually the prince? Uh, we're impersonating him. Things are scripted? Yes, absolutely. <laughs> I have no doubts this is scripted. <laughs> And don't come back. Rude. If that bit for Chancellor Keating's quick thinking would have been completely hoodwinked. So Chancellor Keating is, uh... He's a Chancellor, of course he's evil. I don't even know why, I don't even know why I sit there and doubt it for a second. <laughs> okay... Uh... Guess I'll head back to a more. Dum, 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 dum. Well, that's who impersonating a missing prince whose parents are in a magic coma. Oh, you know. It's, 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 it's it for the plot. Yeah, it's fair. Are you able to recruit enemies in this game? Uh, I think the DS version of 4 does have it. Whereas I think the original version of 4 did not. I think. Who's this MC? What's his background? Uh, he lived with a bunch of people on a, uh, on a floating, I assume, island, maybe? And then he fell down a giant hole and then woke up in another reality, but then that, that other reality also has holes, so maybe he wasn't in a floating island. I'm not really sure yet. 
I think he was on a floating island and he fell down into a realm where he's a ghost who can now enter into another realm where he's not a ghost. And they have to use this thing called Dream Doom to, like, not be a ghost? It's fucking weird. It's fucking weird. Uh, yeah, Caustic? Ha, <laughs> water gun. <laughs> I'm glad people get the joke. <laughs> Yay. Oh, we gained a level. Okay. Guess I'll make my way all the way back to a more. It's like Inception, but it makes sense. Yeah? Oh god, I guess it is kind of like Inception. Late to ask, but what's your opinion on Dragon Quest Your story? <laughs> we were just talking about that. Um, if you've played Dragon Quest V, you probably, you know, had a lot of fun with it. If you've never played it, that movie does not explain a single goddamn thing. And is shameless in not doing so. <laughs> like, it does not care. And then the ending is... something else. But Mike, the spinning top, Mike. The spinning top. <laughs> I actually really liked Inception. Right. 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 Yeah, I already talked with you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is there something I didn't do here? Ba -ba -bum. Church is currently being cleaned. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd like to save, though. So, Spacey, where's your floaty? You're gonna drown. Oh, you know. Just really good at swimming. Besides, it's like, it's like an air sack or something. I don't know how it fucking works. Hi. Yeah, no, I don't want to sample the essence. Only a more essence hits the spot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <gasps> oh, God. I have hiccups again. Hey, the water which furnishes the town that's main industry flows from deep within the northern cave. Once you can venture inside the cave, but about 20 years ago, an earthquake sealed it forever. Yeah? If my old man doesn't know it, then it isn't worth knowing. Huh. Oh dear me, I'm worried about old Evgenia over at the church. She's played by terrible nightmares, poor old dear. I wish I could do more for her. Sorry, I don't know quite why I'm sharing this with a bunch of tourists. Don't mind me. It's okay, I'll just break your shit. If Lonzo gets the drum? <laughs> What's that one? You go drinking a Moore's water, so it bursts with rude health. Yeah, what the fuck is rude health? I already talked to you, right? The cave, right? Right, I already talked to you too. Hmm. Actually, how much money do I have? An ex bandit, I bet she's got some interesting tales. Love struck bandits. I saw some things. So when will it stop being clean? Is this like the town thing where you just gotta talk to everybody? Okay. Right, that thing. I should sell that noble garb I bought. What can we do? I'm not breaking into a church. Would have been nice to offer up a quick confession, at least. 
I mean, we can break into a church if you want. Okay, wrong thing. There we go. How the security HP is at zero? What? Uh, let's sell the sick robe. Silk robe. And sell the other one, I guess, sure. Okay, yeah. Give me that boomerang. Hey, good on you, Enigma. Your Uncle Ricky that spends his days gambling and drinking whiskey somehow makes him 90 years old. <laughs> of all the monsters I face in my time, that old dragon working in the church is the fiercest. It just sounds like you have a treasure. Yeah, right. You nearly know, bit your head off, right. So one thing that I do know about Dragon Quest VI is that there's a lot of progression that is based on talking to just people in the town. It's happened about two times now. And I feel like this is the third. Oh, you gotta love, uh, gotta love, like, the UPS Enigma, huh? Like, like he's just gone now. Okay. Hey, they were sheep of the great shepherdess. Welcome to the house of the goddess. Why is six really weird about that? All right. Age old hiding plans and random NPCs tacked to extend playtime. It's just, it's just funky, because, like, I don't really recall a lot of the other ones doing it to where you had to, like, talk with a lot of people to trigger things. Usually there's, like, you know, the one NPC in town you talk with. Six as you talk with a lot of them. And I had talked to that innkeeper the last time I was here, so it didn't count, so I had to talk to everybody again when I got here. If you speak to Ev Evgenia, who resides downstairs, I'm sure she can come to your aid. Okay. How oh, weird. <laughs> Ian looks very different today, new avatar. Oh, yeah, my, uh, my hyena rig. Uh, I've got a bit of a migraine today, so I've got my lights off me. Tell me, who are you? Who, what did you come here for? I've only bad dreams these days. I'm not in a mood to deal with the uninvited guests. You have business here? If no, you must go this instant. So the priest is telling you you're allowed to stay here? Who does he think he is? I suppose I have no choice. Sleep then. I pray no nightmares will come. Okay. Okay. Nothing special. I didn't know anyone was sleeping in there. No one tells me nothing. Guess the pastor's out again. Just can't resist putting people up for the night. Where'd that old lady go? Sorry, ain't no old ladies around this parish. Yeah? Ooh. Do all the party members sleep in one bed? Yeah, we just kind of stack. You looks like a weasel to you. How concerning. I woke up my children where you guessed at the church last evening. I didn't realize. Anyway, on to the morning's business then. All living creatures are children of the goddess. Yeah, sure, I'll save again. <laughs> it's just a joke. <gasps> a yin in this presence? You know, minus the one behind me. No old woman? No old woman. We're probably in the other world. Considering nobody knows we slept here. Oh. Ew, what the heck is that? 
<laughs> oh, oh my god. Oh. Oh. That's not ideal. Oh. So, that water's probably... My god, a soak of the water that's not... Is that blood? Oh my god, it's like coagulating. It's like, you actually see it like... Uh, like waving around in there. Oh, benevolent god, so we incurred your wrath. Please be merciful for we know not what we've done. Okay. <laughs> Love this model? <laughs> hey, thanks. What do we got in here? What luck, a pair of bunny ears. Oh, wrong button. The crawl is coming? No, God. Millie? Oh, that's good defense. The most fearsome shiver just shot my spine. This can't be a good thing. As if I don't already have enough to worry about my son failing for that new hussy in town. She said she need to find some key inside the cave. She's a sneaky little thief, mark my words. Oh my. This music? <laughs> oh my. Well, I guess it's time to head to the northern cave. Uh, am I healed? Oh yeah, it looks like. Okay. <laughs> Of course, you have an emotion of you flashing your 50 terabyte ass. I'm sorry? That, what, 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 this? That, that, how does that count? How does that count? Quest for dragons again, I see. You are not mistaken. Uh, let's not use magic for the sake of... These are new enemies. For the sake of just conserving... Oh, these things suck. This avatar? Hey, thanks. Shocked person. Oh, this this one. This. God, this episode two times your head, sir. Most types are probably. The blood I wash and I wash, but like paint is like paint. Yeah. Who's standing there? I'm called Evgenia. All has ended for me. All has ended. No treasures hiding here. Just corpse. Ilya, my beloved. He was. I kill him. Me. I'm swinging the sword, and he. Ah, uh, the sword and the blood. The blood, the blood. The blood, the blood. Oh my god. So that's the alternate world of Genya? <laughs> so people do have duplicates in worlds. Jesus. Dun, 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 dun. <gasps> you! Everybody, change tactics! Kill. Hmm. Hmm. Get him. Yeah, <laughs> you bastard. <sighs> Fine. You bastard. All right, otter, maybe. Nuts. Uh, no good. Restore boost to kill the slime? Yeah. All right. Show no mercy, you don't use magic. Now we go. Yeah, y y y hyena? <laughs> a hyena? Me? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I'm, us I'm using this rig because I have a migraine. <laughs> okay. The down is. I'm sorry, ass lore? Y'all keep a. keep a recorded of my ass? Of the smug emote? Oh yeah, same! Ooh, the knights! I'll miss you, Pierre! 
it's on the wiki. Is it wiki? Okay. The migraine goes away soon. Oh, I should be fine. I did take some medicine. We can sell that. We can sell that sword. There's a way down back there. At least the enemies aren't like, you know, not too difficult. And honestly, this new boomerang's putting in work. And Millie's already leveling up. Pierre was the real homie. Pierre was a real motherfucker. I miss Pierre. Damn it. The holy text. Okay. Ah. Yeah, I forgot. I still have I still have healing magic, right? Yeah, I have I have heal. Okay. What's that to Oh I'll forget. Wow, that did nothing, but it did explain to me how that works, so okay. We get Barongo, Barongo, Pierre, Besu. I owe a lot to them. Ah. Medicine power and gift for headaches. I know what you're talking about. Uh, thing is, uh, I have a chronic migraine. So, ah, uh, it's more like I get flare-ups than anything. Unfortunately, I got that from my father. But if I take some medicine here and there, I'll be fine. Hey, usually I just take Excedrin and it works. Ah. But not Toast, she was just present. Hey, Toast was very helpful. Rotten cotton. Oh. I think we should still be fine. Sedge of Migraine Doobie for that. Oh, yeah. Yay. Millie's level's nine. Crack. Ah, she's got ice. Okay. So she does get attack spells. All right. Uh, I'll heal. Okay. Three logs. Now she's cracked. I'm so proud of her. What? Th this log. Uh, okay. Oh, I can't take it back? Okay. I see how it is, you bastard. Rude. I guess it's so bad I have to sleep it off. You know, I'm not able to sleep mine off. My dad can? I can't. It makes it worse. My dad's able to sleep them off just fine. Me? I'm screwed. Cumulus. Cumulus. I hate that thing. Cumulus. Cumulus. Oh no, you missed the treasure. I know, I'm trying to go back. I know, I'm trying to go back. I know! I think I probably went the wrong way twice. Hey, Jillian Naps, thank you very much. Oh my, thank you very, very much. How you doing? Thank you for the raid. How's the deal with Cory going? <laughs> Please, God. Fucking Outlast stream. <laughs> Uh, had rad times, hell yeah. Ugh, glad to hear. Five minutes fourteen is down for maintenance patch. Oh. It's stuck in my head, my head. Are you winning, Spacey? 
You know, I think I'm doing okay. I think I'm doing alright. I died horribly in a ditch earlier. Not ideal, but yeah, it's going well now. I see. File of magic water. When is limits going down? Maintenance for patch Kanto 6? Uh That's a good question. They have it on the they have it on the Steam page. For the uh, the Steam updates. By the way, you're all uh, you're all finishing up Dragon's Dogma 1 before uh, the sequel, right? You know the one that's coming out in uh you know like another Three days or so? You are doing that right. Is this targeted? <gasps> yes. Imagine Spacey's Bleasles to a romanceable character in the BN. I want to call you a bitch and eat your ice cream. Great sword for the win. Fuck yeah, hell yeah. What's this? Oh, it's Iron Claw again. Okay. Wait, should Stardew has an update coming soon? Oh, yeah? Still getting updates? <laughs> so a brat? Me? You eat your ice cream, Rustic? You made it look epic, so I rushed that vocation. <laughs> Hell yeah. No, you can't play somebody using the same copy. Yeah, you can only play the other games like physically. Yeah, that's exactly how it is. Joke's on you, I don't have ice cream. <laughs> Why? This is the first one in like two years. Apparently, Dev just wanted a break from working on his next game. Oh, that's fair. Oh my god. Oh man. Okay. Stam cave. Anything over there? No, there's nothing up there. Okay. Why is this ram have to look so smug? Mm. Uh, maybe it's not a bad idea to... There we go. You ready to silence you as this rant, Sona? God, please, no. It's smug aura mocks me, man. <laughs> oh, there's like throwing hands up there, okay. Uh, well, I'm gonna cast Seal a few times. You think it's better I do it than, uh, Millie? Hey. Yikes, I've never seen anything scary in my life. Thought I'd help myself to a little treasure, but instead I found a guy bleeding out on the ground. He was hurting something fierce, then he got attacked by another monster. At this rate, he's gonna die. Someone's gotta do something. Someone who ain't me. Aren't these, like, the big, beefy, like, almost naked guys that can, like, break you in half with their bare fists? Bruised and bloodied fighters battling a monster. Yeah, okay. Gurgoyle? Hey, Raku Ferret! Thank you for the rain. Good evening. <gasps> I'm gonna end a Disney cartoon. Fuddle dance. Try that again. Oh, I already recovered from that? Okay. Take it. The Fuddle Dance. How rude. Turn the word dance on Spacey. Yeah. 
Gumber, big beef got to bring up his bear fist. I'm here. How may I help? Oh, oh no, bear was like A R E. Not that I'll complain. But hey, good evening, Rock. I hope your stream went well. Oh, wow. Okay. Debuff's fucking rule. Got it. Millie's level increased. Hey. I'm only much gratitude to you. My life, it is yours. I'm called Ilya, the Tempest. Ha ha ha. Big mistake I make here. I know if you're admitting this. The open chest over there and plop goes the monster. Or is it pop? Anyhow, claw my face it does. Next thing I'm no monsters charging Evgenia. Then she... Oh, they're supposed to be Russian. God damn it. Uh, Evgenia. That hot-tempered woman, she's thinking I'm dead now, maybe. Hey, Das, can you be carrying me to top? I'm needing help back up. I'm apologizing for trouble, friend. Yeah, that's fine. Well, that shit. Check again. Okay. Hey, thanks for the help. Wow, you hit him like a ton of bricks. That Ilya guy would've been resting in peace if he didn't come along, I'd figure. D d with him? I mean... Hey, thank you. Don't worry, Carver could just lift you with one hand. Yeah, exactly. That's why we've got the big beefy boy with us. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. Oh, shit. Uh... Just use you back. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, how do I leave? Oh. Do those things like treasure change based on which reality you're in? Yes. Yes, it does. And I see what you mean by that. Hey, seeing as there's no encounters here anymore because I've got this guy with me, let's, um... Let's go try and nab that treasure I couldn't last time. Yeah, this one. There we go. It might not be empty in other reality. It might not. Edge boot... The thing I fucking bought... Okay, I forgive you. Uh, did somebody else use this, actually? The other one I've got? Uh, anybody else? No. Okay, in the bag it goes. So edgy. So edgy. I'm just gonna eat this. Alright. Let's take that. Get out of here. Orange saying gold nice. Yeah, I can't complain too much. <laughs> oh man. Hey. Evgenia. Ilya. You still live? I thought my sword would make you dead and the blood. That is my Evgen, you always have to leap into conclusions. You think I'm dying that easy? I had monster. How do you say it right where I'm wanting it, yes? Thank goodness. Oh, thank goodness. Silly girl, there's no crying in treasure hunting. But I am just... Enough, do you get it? The mirror key? Yes, here. That's my girl, you think I'm being them, but still you get job done, you get item. I was thinking that maybe it could be keepsake of our... Ah, uh, don't be silly. What good is this sake keeping? We need to be moving now, but first one thing. I'd like that, thank you. I'm owing you great debt. I look for key and you help me find it. I need to give something. Yes, here, take, take. Oh. oh okay, sure, yeah. Can I have that mirror key, though? Farewell again, we shall meet, perhaps. Now finally, it's time for Moon Mirror Tower. The key will be opening door. An opening path to Legendary Mirror of Ra. Now off for us. Okay. 
My Tempest? Is that her pet name for him? <laughs> Alright. Wait. Oh, the blood stopped. So she was the source of the blood. That's kind of fucked up. <laughs> Alright. Guess it's no problem if they open the door themselves. Yeah, I guess not. How much was she bleeding? Uh, they barely survived, so I imagine, uh, a lot. You said something about trying to, like, wash her hands, so... Ugh. Uh, can I wear this? Uh... I take off my bandana. Gives me more defense. I guess I give this to somebody else. Maybe Carver, because he's got the least defense. Somehow. Yeah, she thought she was the cause of his death. Hey! I suppose I should be happy things are back to normal, but that bloody water was murder on my nerves. Okay. The trial resumes, so happy I can hardly sit still. Maybe she channels energy into exterminating the bed bugs. Oh. Yeah, maybe you should. Adelia and Evgenia were the talk of the town for a spell, but I guess they left on us, huh? Where'd they go? No idea. Try asking around. Kids play these games with the hell? Oh, I've played so, so much darker games that were for kids. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Well, that's more like it. The trolls will be back in no time. Did you notice two treasure hunters left town? Guess they found whatever it was they were looking for. I have to tell you, out of towners, everything. In fact, I'm so smart, the guy in the house across the river wants to adopt me. I'd ask him what adopt means, but I don't want to sound dumb. Yeah, okay. So not as dark as five? Oh my god, five. God. So I kind of, like, need to... I kind of, like, need to sleep in the church bed again. Can I go in, please? Must be praised the water's pure, but what the heck made it in the first place? Yeah, okay. The item shop. More than more seco. I already talked to you. I already talked to you. Now I beg you. Steel broadsword. be a bad upgrade for Carver, but I feel like it's too early for that. Yeah, dry love. Hmm. Oh, this is the church. I got mixed up. Oh, into the bed I go. fit to fall over. You want to rest up a bit? Yeah, thank you. I wonder how they... I wonder how they feel about me just vanishing from the bed each time. Books are allowed to get so, so, away with so much more gore. Oh, yeah, it's, it's insane. I'll still never forget the Twilight books I read. Oh, God. It's the uninvited guests once more. After you went to bed for sleep and you disappeared into thin air. But wait one moment, you look exactly like people I see in my dreams. Those painful dreams finally stopped visiting me. Last night my dream was different. In the dream he was alive, but in the reality he lost a life in that cave. I stayed in this town alone. But what is that you hold? That ring. In my young days I had a ring just like this one. Okay, so it's not just a parallel world. It's a parallel world in the past. I gave it to someone, but who was it? My memory's not what it was. Truly, it's not the easy thing to grow old. Hope oh, not interrupt, but I'm seeking for the woman with the name of Evgenia. 
Evgenia, my beloved, it's you. I can't mistake those eyes. Who are you? What did you want with my eyes? Those wrinkles cannot hide your beauty, Evgenia. My little cyclone, are you not recalling? Has the gold coin not dropped yet? Do you still not know it is I? It is your Ilya. Ilya, this must be trick, but Ilya lost his life. Could it be? Did you think I'd be dead so easy? Not I. I am searching for you so very long. Ilya! Ah, uh, Evgenia. A, it's a parallel world in the past, and the one we were just in, I think, is our home world? Because in this one, we were invisible. So I think the world we were just in was our home world. So our home world is a parallel world in the past. I never had to plan to come again to this town, but then the dream, it visit me. You two saw the dream, it visit you too? Wait one moment. I get a feeling that this is necessary for you. Take it, it's the mirror key. Calzone receives the mirror key. Yay. It's a Chrono Cross situation. Well, in Chrono Cross, it was two timelines running at the same time. In this game, it's two timelines, but one of them is lagging behind. I have no longer need for the, how you say, keepsake. The real Ilya, he comes back for me. I have a feeling that it was you who saved me from the painful dreams. I have the much gratitude for you. Please travel safely. The ones in the, uh, in the parallel past timeline, they look, they had to have been in like their 20s, 30s, maybe. And here, they look like they might be in their 70s, 80s. <laughs> hey, Bexerath, thank you for the 31-month resub. Another one of my favorite... Gein? Geinzo? <laughs> Buongiorno. Alright. New <laughs> nuke all other timelines. I, you know, I don't think that would be a good idea for a majority of reasons. It's anime rules, they're in their 30s. No, if it's anime rules, they're like 22, and they, can, and they call themselves ancient. They're like Celine from, uh, Star Ocean 2. Oh, man. So, I have the thing now. Uh, I thought we were just dreaming, but this key seems real enough. Okay, off we go. Does your accent in the past affect the other world? It affects the dreams of the future world, I think. Because like she said, it was in her dreams. And for some reason, solving the parallel situation in the past, in the future, helped her dreams. And then brought her lover back to her. So I am... I have no idea what's going on. Where is this one of the Yin? What have you done to Yin? Oh, you know. Oh, you know. <laughs> the answer is I had a bit of a migraine. So I decided to use a uh, PNG tuber <laughs> instead. <laughs> oh, man. Ba -ba -da -bum. So it seems like... Uh, Doing things to the parallel... The parallel world in the past. It's such a fucking weird thing to say. It seems like doing that can affect the present in positive ways, so... Alright. Uh, the what? <gasps> uh, the what? I know the answer if you want to know. No. Nope. So I'm playing the RPG so I can get invested in this story. Get that Luca game, by the way. You got real hard at the end. Oh, what game? Don't be asking. 
Alright, well... I mean, I'm glad you like the Buizel. Oh, I see where I gotta go. Okay. Okay. The Inn is a Buizel for today, yes. I hope you're doing well. Boom, 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 boom. Space Otter. Rudder to rudder. <gasps> oh, 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 that game. That game, Otter Tail. Okay, 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 okay. Right, I didn't mean to play that. Yeah, the Born of a Dream. I do remember that. Buyinzel sounding like a Final Fantasy final boss? Hell yeah. Got my own battle theme and everything. Extreme violence. I, I want to be placed in a video game in the sense that me being there alone uh, raises the rating of the game. That's my desire. Okay. I need to save somewhere. Not there. Now, is there a priest in this town? I need you. Oh yeah, they announced that a few days back, didn't they? Chain sickle. Right, nah, I don't need this. Millie can use the thorn whip, but can't use the chain whip, huh? I mean, I guess I can buy that for her. I don't see why not. If it's an M rank game and you want to raise the age rate, you want to be in an H game? Stand by what I said. Strings that's too low? I don't think that's a thing. Oh, that's good damage. Yeah, I fucking love berries. God, I love the berries. But fuck this. You don't look fit to leave the kingdom. I'd turn back if I were you. The monsters get pretty ordinary. Okay, bye. Whatever you say. So got all the berries of fuck done too. Yeah, ornery. Yeah. Did I assume your first weapons was a sword before the boomerang? I think I started with a club. I, think I had a club. Well, not that way. the highest level, no shit. Yeah, what does Stolfo said? What's the first Dragon Quest you played? One. I've been playing them in order. I played uh, through one, two, three, four, and f uh, five. Now I'm on six. I started from the very beginning. Picked them all up on physical, and, uh, yeah, I've just been going through them. Bum, bum, bum. You thought I meant never mind? Oh, yeah. But yeah, so far, uh, pretty spoiler-free for them. Missed some stuff when you become a weasel. 
Oh, I, I had a migraine today, so I decided to use a PNG tuber instead of having the light on my face. That's all. Dan, I just really like weasels. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> made it made I drew I drew a buizel very very long time ago uh, do what yeah sure Bye, pretend we technically not the chosen hero you still are the chosen hero you're just not the chosen hero but if it wasn't for you nothing would have happened and that's the whole point that's the theme of the game because you're dead because of your dad Anyways, I really liked that game. It was pretty good. Is like a thing down here, maybe? Okay. Oh, there's a thing. All right. I have the key. Oh. Galzon sees a reflection of the glass appears to be an ordinary mirror. I see. It's gonna be a weird dungeon, ain't it? Yeah, so far I'm liking- honestly, I like the whole series. And I'm really liking Six so far, so hey. The progression is a little weird here and there on Six, but overall I like it a lot. Uh, this is way better on Carver, hell yeah. Okay. Yeah, there's a lot of reflection motifs. You should have turned back when you had the chance. Now some reflect on the air of your ways. Your journey ends here. I'm sorry. Corpse sickle. Okay. Dawsbird fan because those mess with around the center. So he's getting pepperoni as a treat. Oh, that's sweet. Surrender your zeep cakes now. Prepare to fight. I'd like to see you try. Venomous vapor. Huh. I like the idea of corpses in the mirror pretending to be you, though. It's kind of neat. Fighting. Keep putting out damage. I have Millie. There we go. Uh, hmm. She'll probably heal herself, so he'll heal me. She's poisoned. She'll squelch. No? Never mind. A corpse party? <laughs> Not quite. I hand well henceforth call poisoning and venomation to sound smarter than I am. <laughs> God. This is a lot of HP, holy shit. Ugh. Ah, 
not a lot I can do personally different, so... It's got a water gun? Maybe. Hey! I love arguing about venom and poison. It's my favorite Resident Evil hobby. Oh. How obnoxious. Water gun upgrade at Kendo's. That sounds dangerous. Good lord. Thank you, Millie. I really am just... I... My allies are doing special attacks in Cassie and I'm just mashing the attack button because all I've got is a debuff and a weak-ass heal. <laughs> oh, man. I love low-level hero gameplay. You don't got shit. That's crack. All right. Hell yeah. Hey. Oh, good XP though. All right. Can't complain. Nearly got to eleven. Snooze. All right. We still poison? Yeah. Okay. Uh, squelch me. Squelch him. Squelch yourself. All right. Fantastic. Either you're really over leveled or they're weak mini bosses. I, that took me a while to kill them. I don't know about over. I don't know about over level. Now, now you see, you see, you see. I command the wolves. Okay, not really. I, I mostly. I mostly just kind of lure them with like a stick and a zebra cake and a string, and that usually works. But hey, you know. I mean, they did so little damage. Yeah. We did a lot of healing, though. I'm, I'm, we're out of mana. I think if they did any more damage, that would have been a serious fucking problem. Oh. Gusto Gustodian? Fuck off. Basic commands them, just don't listen. <laughs> Dude, we have to use magic on this thing specifically now? Maybe we do. Oh, nope, it just has low HP. Alright. Seat of strength. Your third party member's Alpha bounce make you think it's like a wheelchair from the side. It's like a cloth. Oh hey. Gold ring that boosts defense. Sure. That could have been cursed. Alright. Let's eat that. Cool. It's a magic sash. Yeah, let's go with that. You capture humanoid dragons in this game. I don't know. Do 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 do. Fizzled. Oh no! I can't cast spells. I guess I'll just have to throw this boomerang again. Ba -da -ba 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 
What a weird dungeon. Hey, Volk. Welcome on in. How you doing? set of enemies. Just really high dodge chance, very low amount of HP, and high defense. I mean, high dodge chance, high defense, low HP. How fucking weird. Oh, they have Crackle. That's great. Or was it crack? I forgot. So it's like a metal slime? Yeah, it's like a metal slime. Oh. Holy shit. Okay. And then you get a cast spell this soon? I meant casted on me. <laughs> it hurt. Uh, let me do this. Does magic work? Not that Kazuna knows how to do anything but throw a boomerang. Oh, magic works. I just... I just throw a boomerang. Works pretty well. Oh, hey. What's up? You can see me? Yeah, sure. You're short. Finally, someone in this mad world can see me. It's like a dream come true. I think being invisible would be fun, but it's totally boring. Everyone ignores me, or worse, they try to walk through me. I didn't even fix my hair. See my reflection in the mirror? There isn't one. What a pain. I came to this tower because I heard stories about Ra's mirror. It's here somewhere, right? I figured if anything that's gonna solve my, uh, see-through situation, it's the mirror. This isn't exactly the friendliest place in the world, is it? I'm at my wit's end here. Ah, pardon me. Oh, but I shouldn't whine so much. I'm just happy to finally meet someone who can make eye contact. So you're also from the other world. You're going up, right? How about we all go together? Guess the little ghost lady's inviting herself along, eh, Calzone? You let her join the team? Sure. That's that, I guess. We cannot leave her here to fend for herself. We should travel together. All right. Wait a second, I forgot to ask you something. If folks can see you, that means you must be just like me, right? You don't seem to have any problems with your visibility. Come on, guys, give a transparent girl a break. Tell me your secret. Sprinkle some dream dew on the girl? Sure. Galzone takes out the dream dew and carefully sprinkles a few drops on the girl. She's cured. Oh, that stuff's freezing. What's the big deal? Oh, yeah, I'm not transparent anymore. All it took was a cold shower. Why'd I even bother looking for that mirror? Oh, well, whatever works, right? Besides, I got to meet you fine folks. Oh, rude of me. I haven't introduced myself. I'm Ashlyn. I'd love to tell you more, but my name's the only thing I can remember. Can you imagine being an invisible amnesiac? So many questions and no one to ask. Anyway, since we're here, we might as well go check out the mirror together. Sound good? Let's go. Alright. You're a guest. Okay. Oh, you don't even fight. Okay. Devil glass. Party members get? Eh, kinda? Sorta? Oh my. God, I love Garver. Shit. Honestly, this damage, he's kind of carrying us in a way. 
with that. Shit. It's like breaking a curse, but there's gotta be more to it. Probably. What that might be? Who knows? Okay. Uh, I'll just heal some more. Okay. How little Yin's made? Oh yeah, sometimes a spot falls off. That opens something. Stupid! I just realized why that's there, isn't it? Or I'm getting mixed up with something else? Ugh. I hope I didn't just go back down to the bottom of the No, I didn't go back down to the bottom of the dungeon because these guys aren't on 4 1. I should be fine, right? This is different, totally, probably. Okay. Boomerang. Just boomerang. Fuck am I? Oh shit, I really did go backwards. <laughs> All right. The mommy and daddy love each other very much. Well, the mommy eat demands. <laughs> oh, good night, Ryuji. I hope you have a good snooze. Ooh. In hold, go. Enter. Ascend, dang you. <laughs> oh, man. Now, right. Every time, every single one of these games, I always get tricked by jumping off the stupid tower. I don't know, maybe sometimes it'll leave where I need to go, like that one time in Dragon Quest IV. Minus the... Minus the three other times I fell off the tower. Minus that. Oh! They do this thing in this game too? Alright. Cool. So early. The copies. Oh yeah, they did that in a uh, Dragon Quest IV DS uh, uh, as well. It's pretty neat. Shocked expression. <laughs> Gotta love it too. Expressions are awesome. Thank you. Millie can't damage herself much. Yeah, casting uh, ice magic on the person who. Uh, is resistant to it probably isn't a very good uh, good strategy in any way. Huh? Wrong way. God. So much AOE. Two damage on that one. Oh, Carver took 54? What the f- 54? Kill him.
Oh. What the fuck was that damage from? Oh my god. Okay. It's a calzone type of bread. It's like a it's like a pastry kinda. It's bread. But it's filled with things. Oh my god. You have million and dimes that we'd have to leave. Oh god, that thing is terrifying. Holy shit. Okay, let's not go down the tower this time. Off the ledge. What the fuck is this? Okay, that was probably a good thing. I definitely know what I'm doing. I damage hurts user. You know? It hurts my pride more than anything. Alright. I guess now I drop down. Goodbye. Now I go to that tower to the left. Not there. You broke the ord willingly. There. I think you dropped your wallet up there. Loaf. Loaf. Engage. Oh, nobody's holding on to it when he gets there. Hells on Smash being the only thing he knows how to accidentally solve the puzzle. Listen. Calzone's doing his best. Oh. That's kind of sick looking. All right. I feel like Brad could be in that purest, that neutral rebel alignment charts on the left is must be a baked good, must be cooked, must be food, and on the top is yeasty and not filled. Filled and yeasty, filled and not yeasty? Calzone feels more like a bakery purist filling neutral. Okay. Are you going to make a bread alignment chart, Volpez? We're going to make a bread pastry alignment chart. Whoop. It's all flame, so you're definitely going to start casting zap. I don't know that yet. That's illegal. <laughs> it's a kill shot. God. Rude. The pastry alignment chart is called a muffin tray. Go to your room. If I had the effort to give, I would. Yeah, I appreciate the thought, anyways. <gasps> Yay! Pardon me. God, you know what I'd really want to do then? I'd really want to make, like, cupcakes. Like a tray of nine. And then just make each each cupcake an alignment. I think that could be fun. Have it go from, like, white to red? We got space we should make cupcakes. Oh my god, that would be really fun, actually. God, can evil be a poison cupcake? That, no, I'm just talking about cupcakes, not, you know, plan murder. We can pair cupcakes on one side and have it be a Venn diagram. Good job, but... Yeah? 
Yeah, big, big cupcake, no? Just a cake at that point. Squish that, you know, you gotta do is squish that, yeen. Do not. Uh, this is a problem. Ooh, that's fine, it's just one. Okay. I need to heal after this fight. Desperately. Ba if you squish that again, we'll scream. Oh, so I saw a video of a hyena. Uh, a hyena today. Who was sneaking up on a hippo. Uh, see, the hyena thought the hippo was dead. So the hyena walked up behind the hippo, you know, sniffs it a few times, places a paw on it, gets its face a little close, and it starts moving, and the hyena just immediately takes a step back, looks, tilts his head, slowly turns around, and starts tiptoeing away. They're in the water, by the way. He starts tiptoeing away, pretending like nothing's wrong. Occasionally looking over his shoulder the first time nothing there second time the hippo's not moving yet third time He's looking right at the hippo and the hippo just charges him. He jumps away from the bite Because the hippo is rushing towards him and he manages to get away But I would I would like to say how funny it is that hyenas are so smart That they have the knowledge to be like oh shit and then start trying to sneak away and pretend that he's just minding his own business. It is so damn funny. The stairs are there. <laughs> this game's cute. <laughs> he immediately just tried to pretend he did nothing wrong. That's exactly what he did. <laughs> he was like, oh, don't mind me. I'm just a hyena. la di la di la di la di da Oh, shit. Wait. Yeah, wait, yeah. Uh. Just backing away slowly. It's it's the fact that he's so animated when it happens. It's the fact that he's just so, so animated. It's absolutely hysterical. Oh, man. Wait, who's that following you? Oh, that's the uh, invisible girl we found. We gave her some, uh, dream drops, and now she's able to walk around with us. Uh... There we go. No wolf tonight? Oh, no. He was away getting my wallet. Oh. Hey, thanks, loaf. Why is there blood on it? Oh, right, it's down here. Okay. Did I post that vent in the Discord? Uh, no, I did not. I'll post it later. Okay. Dum, <laughs> All right, fantastic. Diana was very close to getting chomped on. It was spooky. It was spooky, but he did a really sick dodge, and that was pretty cool. Oh my, that was pretty neat, I guess. Uh, Discord, check hyena vids. Oh, okay. Uh, wait, how did I get to the thing that just fell? Is it, is it in the center? <gasps> yeah, there it is, okay. Yeah, the middle tower was just being lasered between the two to keep it up in the air. Hey, that's it, Rosmere. Wow, it's even prettier than I thought. Well, I'm glad I get to see it. I guess this is where we part ways. 
only thing is, where am I supposed to go from here? Uh, you guys seem alright, you haven't tried anything funny anyway. Thinking I'll keep traveling with you for a while, sound good? Sure is bossy, not that I have room to talk. What do you think, Calzone? More the merrier, I. I. There you go. Knew you guys were alright. We're gonna be great friends, trust me. <gasps> Thank you, Ashlyn. It's a shame I have to smash it for the Dark Lord. I don't think we gotta smash it. We just gotta, like, you know, hold it in front of the thing, you know. Alright, cool. <gasps> Got a fourth. I have no idea what she does. She's level two. Okay. What are you? Runaway teen. Snooze, sap, frizz, dazzle. Huh. So, debuffer... and fire? Debuffer and fire. No support whatsoever. Alright. Yep, that's our black mage. Okay, we'll just leave. Ah, Bweasel, yeah. Bwe- Bweasel. Like an otter weasel. Okay. Ejecting myself. Gasma says everyone who meets whether they boomerang. I've just got this really good boomerang sitting around, you know. Wait. Oh shit. Hold on, going back. Going back. Yeah, I didn't pick up the mirror. <laughs> God, we go up those stairs really fast, don't we? Hold on, I'm grabbing a mirror. Eh. You'd forget the main qu- I got distracted! They gave me a new party member. <gasps> okay, that was well. That was fine. Gotta get the cardio in. Exactly. Here it is, Calzone, no doubt about it. This is the mirror the king told us about. What do you mean, which king? I'm talking about King Somnus from back in our world. The king and queen have just slept all the time. They ain't sent us on any quests. It was our King Somnus who asked us to find the thing in the very first place, right? Quit trying to confuse me. Okay. Sure, whatever you say. It's like watching his mohawk bounce back and forth. It's mesmerizing. Democracy? Democracy. Ah. Okay. I got a mage. Now I gotta go all the way back to the castle. Alright. You? Uh, sure. Fuck him up. Go ahead. Subs, his name indicates he wants to sleep, though. I think it's a little bit of the opposite. Okay. Ba-dum, ba-dum, ba-dum. Actually, let me check on the mirror. Always reflects the truth. His reflection peeks back. Calzone is somewhat relieved. <laughs> I wonder. The 
Carver. Let's all play past the mirror. Reflection peeks back. Okay. A reflection peeks back. Okay. Got it. Different times now, Dream World and a Waking World? It might be. Don't know yet, though. Ashlyn gained the level? Wow. Imposter check. <laughs> yes, no one is, uh... No one is the imposter. So far. <laughs> hey, you. It's your fault Captain Rusty was forced to fall in a store. Why don't you hop it now? Let's say you got Rosmir. Are you serious? Yeah. You see, that's funny. Would have tossed you in the dungeon and thrown away the key. Oh. No. Uh... Maybe I should go to... Nah, I don't think the captain literally fell on his sword. I should go to an inn? Up in that well in all trades. Right, I gotta go back. Okay. Right, 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 right. Right, right. I gotta go back to the other place. All the way back to Arch, all trades to the well that makes you warp between worlds and stuff. Actually, I should go see uh, Luca while I'm at it. A bunch of her cubs in your lap and leaves. I don't know, raise an army of hyenas. Tell me, what else would you do with them? Okay, I have rested. I am no longer dead. My bones no longer broken. All is well. All is good. Also, hey, Shep, thank you for following. WV Shep, welcome to the Null Patrol. Hope you enjoy your stay here. Okay. This is the first game with the She Slime? No, Dragon Quest 1 has him. Bum, bum, ba -da -bum, ba -bum. All right. There we go. Oh, man. Are they called red slimes? Yeah, but it's the same enemy. Literally the same thing. And they even say how the she slimes aren't even female slimes. Just thought they were female slimes because they're red slimes. So, it, it's literally just the same thing. Falling on your sword? Or falling on one sword? Oh, that either means that you resigned or you killed yourself. Yeah, usually. Alright. Sneep a boy boy. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Madam Luca. Welcome back, Calzone. The crystal ball told Madam Luca that you'd be coming so she turned away all of today's customers. Hello again, my Millie. It's lovely to see you, Madam Luca. I see the flock has taken on a new little lamb, Ashlyn, yes. How'd you know that? Is it written on my face or something? There's no stumping Madame Luca, she's a dream seer. The only name is a piece of cake. 
Your journey goes well, yes? Yeah! I mean, no one's dead yet, I think. Say not a word, Madam Lucas. Did you acquire Rosmere? That must have been challenging. Of course it was. You don't need to see dreams to figure that out. Speaking of that, if you're such a grand mystic, why don't you just tell us how to get the thing, eh? Your mouth is as big as ever, muscle man. Let's call it a night, yes? We can speak more tomorrow. Okay. Severus being barred from our kingdom? It's not even our kingdom. You slept a deep and dreamy sleep, yes? The best kind. So let Madame Lucas see. Yes, you travel between the two worlds in a moor and you got your hands on Rosmere. Been through a lot, mm hmm. It's time for Madame Lucas to tell you the truth about this world. Your keen young minds probably already worked it out, but the world you were on before was actually the world of dreams. This, on the other hand, is the real world. Yeah, the DS version added in, uh, to my knowledge, the monster capturing. But it's not nearly as detailed as 5's, and the original 6 did not have it. In the dream world, you were merely inhabiting the dream of those living in this world. That's why no one was able to see you here in the real world. Well, not one apart from old Madame Luca, of course. So, is Madame Luca making sense to you? Sure. Catch on quickly, yes? You seem to have accepted your fate. Madame Luca was reluctant to explain the dream world before. Why burden you with the fear of disappearing, yes? Dreams can end at any time, you see, and with them, you. That's why Madame Luca held her tongue. Is... Is the plot of this game Final Fantasy X, like... Literal decades before Final Fantasy X? Huh. Decade before Final Fantasy X? Now that you know the truth, Madame Luca will cast a spell on you, the best spell she knows. The spell will light across between the real world and the dream world anytime you desire. Yeah, it looks like we're just a dream. From what from what it seems, all of us who are from the dream world, all of us are just a dream. So we were dreamed up by the conscious world to save them. This is Final Fantasy X! <laughs> Okay. There, it's done. With your zoom spell, you can now fly between worlds anytime you like. That's such a mighty spell takes much out of old Madame Luca. She feels so drained. Well, you best be off. Your world will just keep getting bigger now, yes? So... As we restore the dreams of the people in the real world... The dreams in the dream world expand the world of the dream world? Jesus Christ! Yeah, that's right! That made me think, like, in the very beginning of the game, the three heroes were killed at the hands of the sorcerer at the end. The big evil sorcerer. So if that means that, then that means when the three heroes died, we are the dreams of their subconscious created by them to go into the waking world to defeat the enemy that they weren't able to defeat. Is that what I'm getting out of this? <laughs> huh. I think... I think that's what's going on? Because in the very because in the very beginning of the game, we got to see three heroes, which were the three, not including the character in the back, the team we just recruited. All lost their... lost to the hands. They became... they didn't even... They became petrified. They became petrified. So were their waking dream. <laughs> So does that mean we didn't exist until they started dreaming? <laughs> okay. Were there summons? Yeah, we are the dreams of the people. Uh, they were, I thought they got exploded. I vaguely remember them exploding, but... I don't know, it's, it's fucking Dragon Quest. Maybe when you die, you dream and you... When you- maybe when you explode, you dream. <laughs> Alright, let's go to Somnia. Oh! Eat. Uh, right. Oh, wait, where am I? 
I gotta go to all trades, right? Yeah, we gotta go to we gotta go to all trades, warp, and then go to the other version of Somnia. Oh, there it is. Specifically when you explode, yes. Yeah, this is the dream world, and the dream world exists in a plane above the real world, or maybe both worlds have the fucking holes. I'm not sure on that one. <laughs> Alright. Now we go to Somnia. Alright. That is not dead which can eternal line with strange eons, even death may die. Ah! My god, this is fucking Final Fantasy X. This plot's really fucking cool so far, I'm sorry. People consider this the worst one at times? Really? I, I'm digging it. I'm digging this so far. I mean, I guess worst one doesn't necessarily mean bad, but you know what I mean. You're back in a one piece, no less. Captain Blaine's been pacing the halls waiting for your return. It's like hardest to follow in terms of story. I feel like Madame Luca kind of laid it out right there, you know? Hey, Rusty. Carver and Calzone, too. So, did you find the mirror? Yeah. You did amazing work, you two. Just brilliant. Finally, the last piece of the puzzle's in our grasp. Follow me, King Somnus awaits. It seems overly convoluted. No, I totally get what they're cooking. I, I get it. I get it. The heroes, their heroes, when they're defeated, they dream and create versions of themselves in the dreaming in the in the dream world to save them in the waking world. I get it. I get it. Wait. Oh, oh right. What? Huh? Wait. You discover Ra's mirror also astonishing. Quite frankly, you come through every cave and ruin in the realm for that mirror, but you showed us all up. Captain Blaine informed me of some news that seems too good to be true. Might I understand that Rosmere has at long last come into our possession? Oh my. We're the new game plus! Oh my god, we're freeing! This is the genuine object. From the bottom of my heart, I thank you. Can I get a sultry look from the weasel before I go? This can this is kind of sultry. Maybe this. We have a great new advantage now. We must formulate a new plan. The courageous cover operation this plan would be most appreciated, Calzone. Come to the conference room downstairs later tonight. I'll be expecting great things from you. Everyone else gets as much as you can. Our final battles drawing near dismissed. I think they mean the, meant the, the smug one. Oh, I see. Later that evening. Today I almost sent you a meme, but then realized it's a free run, free and spoiler. I I got to the fucking scene where she flirts, and I about cried laughing. It was too fucking good. <laughs> it's gonna be midnight before long. You may never sleep, but I do. Galzona, could you head upstairs, please? I'll meet you there. Oh, uh, okay, Rusty. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Maybe you're too young to appreciate it, Sonny. Would somebody please take this child home? <laughs> Fucking... <laughs> Maybe you're too young to appreciate it, Sonny. God. Your Majesty, in the name of the Goddess above, what has happened to you? <laughs> Can you hear me or you hurt your Majesty? What's wrong? I don't understand this. He was fine, and then this. Your Majesty, please speak to us. That's probably not good. This is inconceivable. What has happened to our leader? Thanks for coming, Calzone. As you can see, the king has fallen ill. Now you're absolutely positive that was Ra's mirror you brought to us, right? Yeah! Well, Garl said has done something to the king the moment his majesty peered into it. This happened. I can't begin to fathom how the mirror could do this to him.
I... Your Majesty, speak to me. What's wrong, Your Majesty? No, oh, I am Somnus, leader of... Ah! Oh, the mirror's pissed! What in the heavens? Why is the mirror sparkling like that? Your Majesty. Hey, what the fuck? What? By the goddess. What? Your Majesty, you're a woman. Huh? Oh! <laughs> Shit! The throne room fell silent. As the Semo threw it best to keep the king's metamorphosis a secret for now. Huh? By the god, it's the sex change mirror! Comes with the dress. Your Majesty, you're awake. How are you feeling, uh. Your Majesty? Your Majesty, do you have any idea what's happened to you? You transformed into a woman. This is my true more this is my true form, my friend. I'm not King Somnus. My name is Apnea! Apnea! Sleep Apnea? Apnea, Apnea, where have I heard that name before? Chance, we must concentrate on King Somnus for now. Yes, of course, please answer me this, my lady. You are not our king, then what has happened to his majesty? Or does that mean our nation never had a king in the first place? Not at all, my chance. I'm afraid the true King Samnus is in Murdaugh's clutches. What the fuck? Or perhaps Samnus is none other than Murdaugh himself. What? So Murdaugh is Samnus, maybe? Speak sense, woman. Whatever gave you such an outlandish idea? My friend, I can't say. I just know it's the truth. I don't know why I know, but I know. Perhaps some past event in the real world flashed across the mirror and into my mind. I imagine this must all be very hard for you to understand, you inhabitants of this world. You believe me, don't you, Captain Rusty? Oh, so the so the queen of the real world. This is the queen of the real world now into the dream world. I'm sorry, man, but my name's Blade, not Rusty. Rusty Blade, fuck off. Though it's odd how the name Rusty reverberates within my mind. Oh, you're Calzone, right? Oh yeah, hi. You've certainly grown, Calzone. And anyway, we must not let last night's events delay us in facing Murdom. This final confrontation will reveal everything. Including how I became King Somnus in this world, I should add. Yeah, I do want answers. Let us be off then. Or like neck collars slice through all of us like a blade. Well, this changes nothing. I had intended to order you to storm Mordas keep before all this happened. You must continue the attack. As for his majesty, we'll tell everyone that he went with you to defeat Mordas. Still, isn't it strange how Rosmir seems to be at the center of everything? The king was obsessed with it. You find it, and then this happens. A victory over Mordas yields some answers, Calzone. Godspeed to you. The foggiest idea what's going on. Nevertheless, I can't identify this woman. She just seems so regal. Murdaugh's keep is far to the southeast of here. All the eastern mountains south. Cross the check when to continue further east. Okay. <laughs> so, the reflection was the queen for him? Is he fucking dead? Is, is he fucking dead? Did he explode? <laughs> Maybe the dreams and waking queens are reconnected. I... Fucking guess? Okay, now I understand why the plot's a little confusing. <laughs> but we will get answers once we go beating Mordaw's ass, so let's go let's go do that. Heard the news, goddess be with you, soldiers. Thanks. <laughs> ba boom 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 boom. Alright. Alright, alright, okay. What do we got? You got things I can sell? Oh, I totally do. Alright. Maybe we truly don't have any real-world counterparts, or they're dead. 
or they're fucking dead. Yeah, okay, thanks. He thinks it's a different Twitch channel instead of the Yeans. <laughs> oh, fuck, they might think that. <laughs> so, yeah, they're, they're fucking cadaverific. They're, they're dead, dead. So, that might be a problem. So I should probably realistically level up Ashlyn because uh, she doesn't got much at all. Okay. Thankfully, we have the, the authenticator loaf. <laughs> <laughs> the Authenticator Loaf, holy shit. Hey, Horashi? Oh, man. I could show the full model, but it's actually not that much further down. Gold do I have? Right. Okay. Uh, right. Okay. Basically hates having legs. Well, I mean, like... Okay, 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 think about it this way, think about it this way. VTubers with legs, right? Okay. How often do you see those on things like PNG tubers or, you know, VTube rigs? How often do you actually see the legs? And I just... <laughs> Seems like a waste to me. All the time? A lot? I don't believe you. Do we touch up on foot kick? No! Okay. See a lot of you, maybe it's a specific niche I'm in. I feel like I've awakened different questions unintentionally. Hmm. Oh shit. <laughs> Some VTuber have feet camera redeems. I How do you know that? I don't think, uh... I don't think I... I don't think I have a... desire to do that. Right, I, okay, okay. That's... That's a 3D model, though. That's a 3D... I'm talking about 2D models. Or, like, PNGs. I'm, I'm talking about, like, that. That's also 3D. Sky, that's 3D. 100k channel points space will show us the beans. Why do you ask because you want- and No, I don't want suggestions! <laughs> Christ! What have you done to chat? I don't know, but I'm, I'm learning a lot about a few of you. <laughs> learning a lot about a few of you. Ugh. Oh, hey. Oh, hey, dead guy. <laughs> yeah, can I use your bed? Dead guy. All five of us? All right. Let's make a tower, I guess. There's no response, just a corpse. A murderous beast, monstrous beast could have done this. Yeah, please save my game. Please and thank you, Jesus. Yeah. Grazie. Pun on Spacey. Oh. Up for a moment, is chat being weird again? Save me. Okay. It's that Akira Toriyama fan art website. Yeah. The 
compilation site. Oh. So legs. Yo, know, maybe I'm not privy to the world of legs. It just... I don't, know. <laughs> I don't know. Having legs, I don't know. It, it just seems like, like I don't need legs. <laughs> I don't need legs, I guess. Yay! Ashlyn is really, really low level. Really, really weak. Boom. Blue bird. It has one eye. It's dead now. Uh huh, Andy. Dim, bim, 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 bim. Shall we attach hover thrusters to your stumps? Yes, thank you. I'm sorry. Is their attack showing me their ass? What? Don't whip them. Don't whip them when they show their. Okay. That was a crit. That was two crits. Okay. <laughs> Do you caught them off guard? Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> They're about to egg. I really hate that. <laughs> they were about to egg. Shut! Mike? Mike tap? Oh man. We have the HRT mirror and now we're whipping uh, birds as they show us their ass. It's a wild fucking game, I tell ya. Ow? Oh, got my neck. Ah. God, I love just breaking every bone in my body. Oh well. Right. All right. We'll say this make Mr. Quopa. <laughs> I'm sorry. Maybe I should get a new one soon. I just love how cute they are, and then it's just realistic fucking skull in their hands. All right. I should have Ashlyn go on physical attacking as well. <laughs> There we go. Oh, wow. That's a lot of XP. Calzone gained a level. Okay. And that skeleton's really going through it. Oh! Burning man! Is he just on fire? Yeah, I don't think these birds are all right. Okay. Just skulls to remind you that you might be the imaginary friends of dead people. Oh. Yeah, I guess so. Alright. Did your hard MD run for the week? Congratulations. Congratulations. I've got I'm sent on 60 polls for the next season. And way too many crates. I've got like 300 crates. What do I do with these? I want to use them, but I don't want to use them before the thing shifts.
Ow. God, this place. <gasps> Yay! I have too many crates. I have too many crates. I was trying to curve my Faust addiction a bit and not spam all my crates on her. Oh, actually, Millie's going to die soon if I don't do something. There we go. Thank you, Boomerang. Okay. I don't want to talk about my lunacy. Yeah. All right. Let's cast some healing. Uh, everybody else is doing fine, honestly. Okay. Hey, good evening. Yeah, yeah. Going go with the uh, the Bleasalist thing today because uh, I had a migraine earlier and, uh, yeah, I thought not having the light on my face would be a bit better. I didn't want to call off stream or anything, so Dragon Quest. Oh shit, that was damage. What was that, yay? Huh? Excuse me? <gasps> oh, she's dead, dead. Shit. All right. Um. Well, I guess I'm leaving. I should probably buy her better armor. Oh, well, shit. Back to being a ghost. Ah, she's fucking coughing. Ooh, iron helmet. That's good. That's good for me. Hell yeah. Well, um, shit. Let's get the hell out of here. Big pain. Uh. You know what? Weaver's Peak. Ooh, hey, hey. How is my hometown doing? My goodness, Calzone seems so much stronger than when we last met. More and more monsters are skulking around the outskirts of town lately. The world's going to heck. You're our local hero, Calzone. If you can't protect us, who can? Man. Stuff that sucks. Should probably visit the church first. Takes 3357 Magnum to the skull. Maybe I should leave. <laughs> God. Oh, shit. Did we say Millie? Did I tell about Millie music? No. <sighs> you hear nothing. All right. Hey, you. Please resurrect, uh, my friend here. Eepy. Ah, just a little leepy. Not too sleepy, though. Just a little leepy. Hey! Hey! Julie Leopard! Sorry for being entirely late on the ads. <laughs> I had to goof with my alerts earlier, so I'm a little bit slow on a lot of things. But hey, thank you very much for following, and welcome to the Null Patrol. And Sinkad, welcome to the Null Patrol as well. Thank you very much. All right. Oh, God. Ugh. Sorry to me. Let's go do a thing. And by that I mean check the stores and take a fucking nap, because oh my god. She's real beauty, ain't she? That armor's a chant, you know, but don't, don't touch. It costs 7,000 gold coin in my shop's pride and joy. Sure. Well, you're buying it, really? Well, it's all yours. I was wondering about this armor. I wanted to come back to it. 
Okay. It's in the bag. Summer will help reduce damage caused by magic. Oh, shit. Oh, wow. That's really, really good. Um, Carver can't use it. Uh, give it to Ashlyn. Why not? Her stats are really bad. Maybe that'll keep her alive a bit. Gotta love Millie's music. I didn't know she did the uh, did the intro, uh, the second intro for Goblin Slayer either. I really need to watch that at some damn point. Uh, let's zoom to Somnium. We can just uh, we can just save there and heal, or we can just heal there, then make our way back down to that one place. <laughs> so yeah, hopefully this will uh, help keep Ashlyn alive a little bit longer. She got nuked the last time. Good god. Also, Millie's HP is so low, Ashlyn's already catching up on her. Shit. Alright. Okay. Down to the southeast. So damn curious about this game. More so than, like, any other Dragon Quest. Just going into it. Knowing that, uh, not many people have played this one. This one's kind of like the redheaded, this, the, like, redhead stepchild of the group kind of thing, you know? Not a lot of people have, like, really looked into Six. Did you see the first one, too? I don't know. I've only heard the second intro. I'm not aware. Like I said, I don't watch Goblin Slayer. Maybe at some point, though. The only thing I know about uh, Goblin Slayer was the Crunchyroll controversy. <laughs> Which was awful, but really funny in a fucked up way. Goblin Slayer does have a hot lizard, man. Oh, yeah? God, so much AoE. Crunchyroll controversy. <laughs> so when uh, when Goblin Slayer got released, uh, Goblin Slayer was rated PG, or I think it was like rated G for general audiences. I think it was PG because whoever pushed out it onto the website didn't actually check what the anime was about and the ratings for it so everybody went in to see this like you know cool new shonen anime about goblin slaying and this big cool nike on the front cover if you've seen the first episode of a uh, goblin slayer uh yeah that is not for general audiences <laughs> that is that is not for general audiences so they got a lot of shit for that because a lot of people, particularly people who aren't familiar with that kind of content and younger people, all saw that. And many kids were scarred that day. Yep. Yeah, yeah, that that anime has a hard R rating. <laughs> it's a that's a that's a very hard R rating. <laughs> oh god. Please, Maze. Oh, man. I do want to watch that anime at some point, though. That's <laughs> showing for general audience, debatably no audience. Oh, man. Oh, man, I saw that. Interspecies reviewers, yeah, Crunchyroll stopped, uh... Stopped subbing it. They, they canceled doing the subtitles for it, which is really weird, because there's a lot... A lot raunchier stuff on that website. God. I was one of those people there isn't enough eye bleach. I am so sorry, Mango. Please, Spacey. Maze, you want me to you want me to want me to want me to want me to scratch you on the head? Shangri-La Frontier? Not heard of it. Wait, yes I have. Yes I have. That's that. That's that, um. 
that MMO anime that doesn't take itself like hyper seriously. And everyone said it's really refreshing in the sense that the the main character is just a guy who has like a job. Oh man. Get in. That's not the case of all localizations. Interspecies reviewers, oh yeah, that one, uh. That 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 was a weird case. Oh man, that that was that one was a that was a particular weird case cuz um oh god. Hold on, before I stick a foot in my mouth. Right. Yeah, that 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 one's a particularly weird one in the case cuz like if if I'm not mistaken, the protagonists of that uh of that anime are like, you know, all adults, and the anime is rated for adults. <laughs> I'm just... I'm just saying, there's a lot worse on Crunchyroll that they have subtitled. <laughs> a lot worse. Very questionable at best. Oh, man. Redo a few. Oh Jesus, we are not talking about redo a healer. I'm going. I'm going to put my foot down on that one. No, we're not. We're not. We're not talking about redo a healer. No. <laughs> Ashlyn gained the level. Hey, that being said, uh, did you know that there's a, did you know there's a Dragon Warrior show that was made for uh, American audiences back in like, oh God, like a long time ago, like an actual honest to God Saturday morning cartoon Dragon Warrior. Uh, and it's wild because it still has like, uh, it still has like Akira Toriyama's art style and everything. It's based on a uh, Dragon Quest three. It's based on three, but it is an original story. Yes. Uh, wild though, absolutely wild. I haven't looked much into it, but apparently it, it does have, you know, Japanese uh, subtitles and everything, but it was made for American audiences. Yeah, and it's uh, based on the first Dragon Quest. I read it was based on three, but like the pro tag gets the hero's armor. Uh, maybe I re maybe that was just because I was reading an old uh, an old review site, uh, like old, old. Oh, man. Oh, I got my fingers. Ugh. But yeah, really wild. I want to check it out. I want to check that out. I want to check out... Check out... Uh, bleh. I want to check out that uh, Legacy of Die, or whatever it's called, uh, anime. There's an old one and a new one. And I haven't really heard any bad things about, like, any of the Dragon Quest anime, so... Eh. Why not, right? I want to give it a shot at some point. So that armor is doing her wonders. Oh my god. Ugh. Really? The whole... Okay. Mm. Oh my god. Why does the guy who hits the hardest have to be the one that's confused? Ugh. 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 I've never heard of it, Sloveness. Okay. Alright. Have you ever seen Spider Riders? The only thing I know about Spider Riders is, like, the theme to Spider Riders. And like literally only like one note of it, the whole calling all spider riders. That's literally it. Hey, Mayan, thank you for following. Welcome to the Null Patrol. I hope you enjoy your stay. And isn't that the bastard that I just fought in the previous dungeon? Can I just deal with you? You're not doing a lot of damage, actually. Um there. Fuck, 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 fuck. Okay, that's a problem. 
Ugh. Show no mercy. Okay. Ugh. That was mildly terrifying. They say I associate spider riders with stomach pains. Oh, jeez. Okay. Let's use that. Use my max MP again. I don't think there was anything to the left. Ooh, actually, I really gotta heal, uh, Millie. I really gotta stop doing this. Oh my god, that is the worst. Ugh. Oh. Ugh. Oh. oh my god. Okay. Let's heal Millie. Oof. These guys are a pain in my ass. Play Spacey slowly becoming one with that boomerang? Oh, you bet your ass. God, it's like, it's like Pokemon Sand Attack if it hit the entire party. And was way better than Sand Attack. Good. God, alright. Everything's well. Everything's good. Oh, man, oh, man. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. <laughs> Oh my. <laughs> Even talking about get out of here. Even sad things hit you a bunch of times and missed that much? Yeah? Yeah, it sounds about right. Okay. Uh let me take a second. Heal up the group. Okay. Fantastic. Remember Dazzle being that affected? Dazzle has always, always been that effective. It literally the worst thing, the worst thing in this fucking series is Dazzle. I cannot stand it. Oh, man. Wait. Uh, was it upper? Oh, shit. God, the encounter rate of this. Oh, my God, look at that. Okay. Okay. Uh, show no mercy. Ooh. that one there we go as long as that thing is gone I'm content ow 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 Jesus The use no magic and five alarm fire tactics. God. Okay. Alright. Out we go. Okay, okay. Right, I'm fucking lost. Uh was it the stairs up? It's like every time I get into an encounter, I get disorientated. Nah, you again. 
Okay. Thank you, Millie. Ah, uh, truth be told, Millie, I really don't want her to use magic. Ashlyn can do it, I just don't want Millie to waste her healing. Ugh. Yeah, it was here. Okay. Into this maze. Right, I was going to the left when I got caught. Hmm. Driver's headshot is quite the image. Yeah, Android 16 scares me a little bit. Argyle? Yes. Yay! Oh. Ashlyn. Okay. Neat. Right, thank you. That's what he looks like. Yeah, Android 16. <laughs> You know, the really cool thing is around this time is when Akira Toriyama really had, like, that art style. And, um... Oh god. I wonder if I can't, like, find a good image of it. Uh, let's see. I don't know how to explain what that art style means, but maybe if I could just, like, find an image of it really quick. A few images. Kind of like that in a not shitty resolution. Uh, go like this. Yeah, there's such a better version of this. Oh, there it is. Yeah, okay. So, like, yeah, in this period, like, Toriyama had a... I don't know how to describe it, but it's a, it's an art style that I feel like was really big with, like... Uh, like Dragon Ball Z at the time. In that sense. Like, it looks like this. The art style is what I mean. I, I don't know how to explain it. But... It feels like this is when his art style really, really started looking like what we'd see, like, later down the road, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Like, it's it's in this moment I'm like, yeah, that, those look like Dragon Ball characters. In a way. Early Z, late Dragon Ball. Yeah. Yeah, in a way. This is like the, this feels like almost like the exact moments. Oh, hey, Corey, good evening. The exact moment when they kind of just started looking like that. And there's trunks on the left, Krillin wearing Kid Gohan's hat on the right. <laughs> yeah, very, very Saiyan Saga. Very Saiyan Saga King Piccolo kind of shtick. Or not King Piccolo. Um. Oh. Well, yeah, like Piccolo Jr. Oh, man. What are we doing again? Oh, it says up there, right. Uh, yeah, okay, that's fine. I keep forgetting how some of the Dragon Ball Quest characters look like Dragon Ball characters. Yeah, they really, really do. I mean, we've seen Wide Piccolo as a final boss before. Ah, uh, that... That is true, we have seen Wild Piccolo. Wild. Wild. Wide. I can English, I promise. Fucking Gustodian. Okay. Uh, hey, Jacob Gomez. Good evening. <laughs> How you doing? Yeah, let's see what you. Heal myself. Uh, don't heal Ashlyn yet. Right. This is where she dropped dead last time. Let's uh, let's try and avoid that now. Why, thank you. I'm glad you like it. I 
<laughs> basically, I, I woke up today. I, I almost canceled stream because I started getting a really bad migraine. But was like, hey, you know what? I'll just take my medicine. I'll dim the lights. I won't use my uh, V-Tube like, ring light today. And I'll just use a PNG tuber and I'll have fun with it. This is what I had for uh, some Pokemon streams that I was planning on doing. But wound up not doing so. And I've been meaning to use it more, so it's like, eh, why not, right? Why not? Oh yeah, Clint did a very good job on the poses. Very, very good job. He wasn't just a Namekian, he was a super wide Namekian. That should be Piccolo's final form. You know, now that he's like got, you know, the whole like orange Piccolo mode. He should just get really wide. Oh boy. Do, 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 do. Me as a slime, please. Alright, I'm gonna cast sap. Casting sap on this guy sucks too, because like. It's like I need to use magic on him, or, yeah, magic to, uh, lower his stats. If I don't, I'm fucked. Oh, Kaklang? Uh... Okay. Well, I'm gonna hit you now. Fucking Kaklang? I've, I've never seen an enemy actually use Kaklang. I don't think I have. Yeah, Iron Eyes. <gasps> Yay! I think there was an enemy in 4 that used it. Really? I never saw them do it. Carver gained a lot of stats. Holy shit, that was like plus 3 to most and plus 10 HP. Oh my god. Shit. Still think it's very funny Carver is my highest level character. Essentially it's protect. Nothing can hurt them, but they can't act. Yeah. Well, the moment Orange Pickle said it's vitamin C time, it throws a bunch of chancerines at him, please. Uh. Oh yeah, one of the uh, the, the hero of three, I think, learned Kaklang. Okay, I'm not doing this. Oh, oh my God, the flea worked. Holy shit. Sorry, that's just so rare that happens. <laughs> it's so rare the, the flea raid actually works. <laughs> this series is kind of a dick about it. Oh man, hello Dragon Souls, because when you're surprised by what just sounds like making random noises, it kind of annoys me a little bit. <laughs> I'll be totally honest. Because some, some of the spells are just f like fucking... Fucking cockadoodle doo man. Cockadoodle doo. Shut up. <laughs> God. It's fucking cockadoodle doo. There's fucking puff puff. Not puff puff. I'm sorry. Uh. Oh my God. What was it? Was it puff puff? What's the fucking dragon spell? Oh my God. Kaboom. Kerplunk. Squelch is the worst. What is fucking happening with Squelch? What? It what is happening with that? The dragon spell is B Dragon. It was B Dragon, but it's not B Dragon. Wasn't it? I swear to God, B Dragon had another name. Hold on. I know it's Antidote. <laughs> I know Squelch is Antidote. B Dragon. Well, what is what is this fucking? I swear to God that had another name in one of the ones I played. I swear to God, it did. B. What was it? Is it just Puff? Huff and Puff? Puff. Yeah, Puff. Fucking Puff. Oh 
Because there's two localizations of Dragon Quest. There's Dragon Warrior and there's Dragon Quest. I, I think... I feel like the Dragon Quest ones are a little drunk. Just a little bit. <laughs> Puff the Magic Dragon. Puff is Dragon TF, Puff Puff is Titty. Yes. <laughs> I know that. <laughs> Maya uses Puff and Dragon Quest Heroes. She's the first uh, pro tag, I think, who ever gets it. In uh, Dragon Quest, at least from what I noticed. Yay! Yeah, zone gained a level. So proud of myself. Pat myself on the back. Yeah, 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 yeah. The repost be Booba Dragon? No, I think you just explode. Not like a not like a fantasy explosion either. I think you just like turned to a gore mist. Oh, okay. <gasps> oh, you heard nothing. Absolutely nothing. Love the name Calzone, thank you. Now want a Calzone? Go get one. Go get a Calzone this late. Follow your dreams. I will never forget, I think it was Dragon Quest 3? Or was it 2? I think it was 2, if then not another homosexual. <laughs> Gormis is the name of my heavy metal grunge band, fuck yeah. I don't have hiccups. It was 2 if I remember correct. It was 2, right. <laughs> oh man. Da -da. I think Spanish. Ashlyn's level increased, yay. Oh, zoom. That's good. Boom, 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 boom. Hold a moment. Our nemesis is a trickster. He may not appear in his true form. He is Murdan nonetheless. Do not be fooled by his traps. I'd like you to carry Rosmir from now and keep it the ready. Oh, we'll just be off then. Okay, thanks. The door is firmly locked. <laughs> okay. What's that there? Ah. Ah. You know, I don't think I actually found the Puff Puff in Dragon Quest 3, funny enough. I don't think I ever got that one. I got Puff Puff from 1 and 2. I don't think I found 4s? My kingdom for Holy War to lessen the encounters. <laughs> you, yeah. Just pressing a bunch of buttons today, huh? What? <gasps> oh, I'm turning on the lights for the dungeon. That's really cool, actually. Holy shit. I'm opening up light by, uh, opening up these grates. That's sick! Okay... Let's go activate the other ones, then, that I found. Dragon Quest rerun, any Puff Puff percent? Play every Dragon Quest game till I get Puff Puff? It's not a bad idea. I was like, come below these ground grates. Oh, there's like light above us, probably. It is like a castle thing. Oh, man. I think it's an actual challenge. I'd believe it. Get Puff Puff as early as possible. Alright. Uh... Right, it's down here. Okay. I can see! The fact that this dungeon exists to show off hardware is not lost on me. <laughs> and of course! Uh, 
Oh, man. You know, I didn't even think about the torches there. I can see! I can fight! I was thinking and I didn't say it. That scene lives rent-free in my head. Dancer's costume. Uh, this would be good for Millie. Uh, it's very, very slightly better for Millie. All right. Okay. Do you know this dungeon, Light Dungeon? I, I don't know what the name of this dungeon is. Boom, 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 boom. Oh my god. <laughs> Millie, can you put on the stripper costume? You open the chest, you find a dancer's costume, you look at it confused, you see a ghostly visage of Maya giving you a thumbs up in the distance. Millie's level increased level 14. Nice. I uh, saw so have have damage to what? Or to the fur cape? <clears throat> Pardon me. This is gonna suck. Okay. <laughs> All right. Should I use the mirror there? More style. I don't think style does anything. Wait, there's a metal slime! Get it. Get it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Finally! First metal slime of the game. God, it stayed for three turns. I have never seen a metal slime stay for three turns. So rare that it does. Oh my god. How do I get into that? I need to crawl up from below into that hole there. Directly to my right? Does an angry metal slime want a blood? Oh yeah, I believe it. Oh! I, you know, I thought it'd be like a... <laughs> okay. And I go. Okay. Alright. Uh... Alright. Is there one alright? If anyone's in, be sure to heal quickly. Okay. Right. His reflection peeks back. Calzone's somewhat relieved. Uh, you know, I thought maybe if I went lower. Okay. I need to get there to the right, in the center. Right up there. Should be some stairs. The fuck, do I get there? Hmm. Don't metal slime man's wanted blood? Yeah, no kidding. One. How you doing? Good morning, good morning. Stanley has two uses, one of those is only used one in class. Possible just for that specific case of the cost of defense. Probably. Okay. Uh, alright. Alright, alright, alright. Maybe I'm overthinking this. Let's go around this whole way. Okay. 
Okay. Got these guys. Come on. Only by nine, though? Okay. Let's keep going. And if I enough, the closer I get to the bottom of this dungeon, the easier it gets because I don't have to deal with the damn gargoyles. Love you, Saturday. Hey, thank you. Uh, using this uh, for the time being, ju just for today. that for uh, I'm in agony yeah okay so I think I get it but I gotta get there to find out okay you Ashlyn you yourself now okay Oh, these guys suck. He's a dazzle. Thank you, Carver. Okay. I was really worried that second was gonna dazzle. Now. <laughs> okay. I didn't feel like I stepped on a hole, but I did. Okay, we just... I did this fine the first time, and I'll never do it fine again. That's so strange that being dragged into the Dark World Scouts by some people she just met. I mean, she was an invisible amnesiac. Where else is she gonna go, right? Ow. Basically, the hole is always with you. I'm having a stroke. At least I'm getting XP. Okay. It's time to start breaking out Millie's magic. Okay. Fantastic. The perspective's fucking with me. She could rotate it. Oh boy. <laughs> hey, thank you, Shwen. Hey, how you doing? Good evening. You want to take care of yourself too? Oh, I'm hydrating. I'm I'm liquidating my body and all the nutrients that I need. Now I assure you of that. Okay. Shit. He becomes liquid. Yep. You know. Depends on the day. Hey, Sachi, thank you for the 26 month resub. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Damn, kind of, yeah. Oh, and hey! Yeah, Alberton, thank you for the two gift subs. Thank you very damn much. I think I know what to do. Oh my god. Yep, that was it. Okay. Hey, thank you very much. Also, Elsie Dragon, if he's still there, thank you very much for following. I hope you enjoy your stay. You're welcome to the Null Patrol. All right. All right, all right, all right. Good morning. Hey, buongiorno. <laughs> I can walk into the center. From the left, which is faster if I just drop here. All right. 
Excuse my beard, by the way. Oh, okay. Ah. Okay. Oh, Sachi. Thank you very much for the gift sub as well. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, my nose. Yeah. Thank you very damn much. Hi, hi, hello. Now let's stop getting my head bump, 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 bump. Rude. Okay, let me go this way. How dare you use that kiss emote on me? <laughs> How dare you? Now I go this way. All right. Stellar. Um, healing would be nice. Oh, even though our MP is really doing bad. Oh. Why Ashlyn doesn't even have MP left? Oh, boy. Okay. There we go. That is a big boy at the end of the hall. Um, okay. Holy water, Chimera Wing, Pretty Betsy, to increase style. Okay. Uh... Medicinal herbs. There we go. Nice, well, they're cheap as hell. Okay, when are they what the queen thinks of falling in the hole so much? Eh. I'm sure, everybody in this universe is used to it at some damn point. Right. I don't think we really have much of anything else besides magic water. Okay. Um, right. What's my favorite turn-based RPG? Hmm. Might be... Might be... Final Fantasy VII, Chrono Cross... Well, Final Fantasy VII is ATB, but, um... Maybe that or that. Uh... Or Dragon Quest IV, admittedly. Uh, Dragon Quest is kind of like slowly winning its way into my heart. And so in Dark Rizzo will try to finish from watching your stream, got admit what it pretends to be for the first part of the game was it all for me, so I stopped playing it. But learning what it becomes later convinced me to try it again. Oh yeah, it, it just genuinely gets way better and better as it goes. When you get to Bitter Black Isle, that's like, like absolute peak of that game. Hey big boy. Well, well, back to try and slay me again. How splendid. Normally, I relish just diversions, but right now, Destiny Calls, I have a world to rule, you see. Your Destiny Calls to you, know it's your fate to serve me. Now, bow before the mighty Murdaugh or die. Okay. Okay. Let's see here. First turn, just lay way on him, I guess. Whale on him, I guess, I mean. Uh, okay. Oh, you sap. And I'll attack. There we go. Crotch, crotch root? What does that mean? Party's tactic change. Oh, really? Oh, really? You're 
perfectly fine that way. Um, okay. There you go. Ow, 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 ow. And you sap again. On the Skype. Wow, you suck. Frizzle. You're so rude. It's fluffy? <gasps> I am a bit fluffy. I'm doing good. I'm living. How you doing? Doing quite alright. Just uh, deal with this thing. Kind of reminds me of Cell. Just a little bit. Mostly just the green. Don't use magic party tactic change. That's really not that big of a difference. Especially not for this turn. I'm gonna hit you again. Rude. Ow. Ow. Rude. First wide Piccolo and now wide Cell. We're getting a collection. There we go. Again. Until I scream out that Pokemon, please. Changing Carver to focus on the healing is really funny, because what the fuck is that going to change if I'm just going to start beating you with a stick harder? You'll probably think that's healing. Uh, well, Millie's actually out of MP, so I mean, really. Show no mercy, I guess. Oh uh, yeah, we even watched some uh we even watched some Dragon Ball on the Discord. Oh, I'm a bad healer. Okay. But I am a healer. Uh you get up. Gonska's Dragon Ball Evolution? That seems a good trade-off. Ooh. Ooh. Focus on healing, please. Nobody here is focusing on healing today. Carver again. Love those dodges. Oh, they feel good. Let's throw a heal on Ashlyn. Even though she's not doing much, she's still helping. Is the boss... I think the boss ran out of mana, too. I think we all just fucking ran out of mana. <laughs> Everybody was just fucking drained. <laughs> Slap fight moment, that's really what it was. Oh shit. It's a lot of XP though, damn. Calzone went up, Carver went up. Damn! Alright. Ashlyn went up, Millie doesn't get shit. Alright. This is not my destiny. You think I'm defeated? You don't know the meaning of true defeat. I'll teach you when we next meet. 
Until then, <laughs> The mirror! Oh, I see. What if you just say no? Oh, is the mirror just fuck him up? Brought me a gift, have you? Nanny? <laughs> he tried to hide in the other world. Oh, right. This is something about the king being like him. So why did you turn to a monster? Oh, man. Hey, have a good night. Sleep well, Goldine. Was nice seeing you. Have a good snooze. Somnus. Oh, man. Apnea. Oh, Apnea, my beloved. By the goddess, how in the world does that one appear? Hey, Tenki! Thank you for the raid! Good evening, good evening. Hello, hello. How you doing? Oh, let me just, uh, let me just take a thing. Oh! Grazie, brave. It's your corporate obligation? <laughs> I'm safe with my corporate obligation for now. But hey, good evening. How's Pacific Drive? You are Murdaugh, my dear. You played the role of the Dread Fiend in this world. Me, Murdaugh? It sounds preposterous, yet I know it to be the truth. But why, how, my mind, everything is just a blur right now. Good story. Ah, no shit. It's as if I'm still dreaming. It's because you're fake! You are a dream! Oh wait, no, you're actually from the real world. Never mind. I must be in the dream world. Yes, that would explain everything. Am I right, Apnea? And your companions? I suppose they are denizens of the dream world? Now that I have a good look, that young fell resembles our son, does he not? Uncanny. Is this, is this my mom and dad, but I'm not real? There you are, I feared for your safety, so I let a platoon of my own here to the underkeep. Is this really Murdaugh's lair? I've seen no sign of him anywhere. Best of her dragons, huh? Maybe. Well, if it isn't my faithful companion, Rusty, flying to my aid as usual. That name again, how many times do I have to say it? My name is... Your Majesty! Indeed, I must apologize for all the trouble I've caused you. But this is no time for idle chit-chat, there's much work to do. Escort myself and my queen back to the castle at once. Oh yeah, the, the MPs, the monsters that have no MP to cast certain spells early on. There's one monster that tries to scare the shit out of you by casting thwack or whack at you, but doesn't actually have the mana to do it. I suppose both Apne and I owe you all a great debt. You must visit us at our castle later, you'll be richly rewarded. It's a really funny troll- oh, I- I think it's hysterical. Okay, can we talk about how I have, like, no mana left and I- Do I know evac? Oh, no. Nobody knows evac, do they? Oh, no. <laughs> okay. Alright. Let's see here. Now I've got all this bunch of fucking holy water and the- Arm a more seco essence. Oh, it sucks. Alright. Oh. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> yeah, it's really what is full pass. Alright, the whole Okay. Gonna walk my ass all the way back out of here. Oh boy. Maybe if I'm lucky they'll be nice and not spawn enemy encounters on me. Be really sweet of you, Dragon Quack. Ah! Okay. Dun, 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 dun. So I always have me save the last few mana points. We couldn't. We couldn't afford that. Is Major sure a Weasel now? <gasps> yeah, just for today, though. We do have holy water. I could use holy water. I never use holy water because I can- because holy water never fucking works, but you know what? Let's give it an honest shot. Let's- let's- let's pray holy water works in the sixth fucking game. 
Oh my god. <laughs> I, fu <laughs> I fucking hate this game sometimes. <laughs> Holy water is full of shit. It has not worked for me in a single goddamn game. It only gets rid of weak encounters. Uh, it's you, you have to be you have to be so high level. So high level for Holy Water to actually work. I looked into that algorithm for like I think like the second game. You have to be really fucking high level over the enemies for it to actually work. You just aren't bang. Holy water is a fucking myth. At that point, you're strong enough to just deal with them anyways. Oh, fuck that. Uh, Blue water only works if you're grinding like you don't stream. Man, just... Do they gain current MP or just max MP on level? You get max MP, you don't get current MP on level. The game does not heal you when you level up. You just suffer. Ugh. Glad uh, you have a good honor time. Hey, snooze well, Kaden. I hope you have a good rest. It was nice having you here. Oh, I don't want to fight these. Okay. When are you doing Dragon Zama Tour? Is that not on the cards? It's not out yet. Uh, I was hoping to do it on release, though. Really don't like these. Oh no. You know what? Go for it. If you had to choose when you order stickers online, would you want those strawberry filled candies or a set of gums? What? Strawberry filled candies. Give me the strawberry filled candies. I hate gum. I just want to feel like a sexy otter every now and then. Is that so wrong? <laughs> okay, up we go. Up we go, okay. Just gotta go around here to the edge and then take a right and fuck. Mm. I should. Damn. Okay, so long as I make sure I have the enough, enough mana to cast Zoom. Oh, which is only one mana in this game. Okay, that's that's a relief. Okay. Evax the expensive one. Got it. Uh, so, oh, I did not mean to click on myself again, but you know what? Maybe I'm just worth it. Maybe I just want that much HP. I love gum if it never lost its flavor. I gotta be honest, I'm with Willy Wonka. Gum is fucking disgusting. I don't like it. <laughs> I... I I don't like them either. <laughs> I think gum is really gross. I absolutely agree with Lily Wonka. You chew and you chew and you chew and it just gets like everything up in it and it just... <laughs> uh, everything's up. <laughs> oh, otters are fucking mean. Alright. Sometimes they have guns. More than a cow does. Yeah, I love strawberry candies, though. Oh, my God. It's like a reward for sucking so much. The strawberry candy. Don't take me out of context. Don't take me out of context. I was just saying because crunching it hurts your teeth is what I meant. It's because crunching hurts your teeth. Don't don't clip it. Bullpez. It's a good thing. <laughs> Face when are you in context? I like to think most of the time! I'm probably gonna be in the area in a few weeks. Oh, no shit. I would love to say hi. I know you're like, I'm talking about- Just talking about the hard candies. I can't- I can't- I can't just bite down on a hard candy. I mean, like- Man, I, if I use any vernacular here, would you eat the Wonka's blueberry pie flavored gum? No, gum is disgusting. 
I mean, blueberry pie, yeah, I love blueberry pie, but I'd rather just eat blueberry pie. I don't want to chew gum. It's gross. I did you a mercy and add its context. Thank you, Volpress. You want to turn into a blueberry? I thought that was like the four-course meal that made her turn into a blueberry. Isn't that, isn't that what it was? It was like a, it was like a full meal or something. It was like experimental. It's a violet. You're turning violet. Yeah, the four-course meal gum. Yeah, yeah I remember that now. Uh, gone Twitch in 1080p, you know? Eh. Eh. That scene changed me tragically. Oh? Da, 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 da. When you taste the pie flavor, that's when it happens. The pie's the scariest fucking part. I fucking love blueberry pie. I don't, I don't want to die. I don't want to get put into the fucking juicer. There we go. I'm free! The king went ahead with Captain Blaine, the others are probably waiting for us at the castle now. Alright. Get the fuck out of here, holy shit. Ugh, alright. It was way harder than I thought it would be. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I have nothing left. I've only died once this stream, though, and, you know, given my track record of these games, that's a pretty good thing, I think. Alright, let's go to the inn. Get to spin up before you reach the dessert stage. God. It's like, wouldn't that just be, like, really gross if you're, like, eating gum and it starts tasting like roast beef? I don't know, it just... It kind of, kind of like, freaks me the fuck out, if I'm being honest. You spent so much time in just one area of this game, you can tell how long the game is going to be. You know, uh, six is shorter than five, actually. It's actually, uh, extra popular opinion. Alright. Let's save. In this case, I must overwrite Calzone. That is fine. Ba -bum -bum. Five so far is the long- Five is- Definitely the longest, yeah, so far. <laughs> I'm gonna get that starvation on the couch. Oh! I. Well, d well don't die of starvation. You only go with, like a hot pocket. The hot pockets are good. Corn dog. Um. Yeah, I do. Somnia Castle. Oh, it's you. Come in. You go eat too, Brave. That is hot pocket. What does that even mean in a lewd context? To use that face. My face. They wear my faces. They wear my faces. <laughs> I'm trying not to sneeze really hard. I'm trying. That's a sneeze really hard right now. Ah! Oh, God, my ear pop! Ah! Oh, yay! I'm good. I'm good. Hi, how are you? Well, you're back. Do you know where Captain Blade is? No. You know what made the return trip ahead of you? Well, they certainly aren't here. Well, there's more and more King Samus in a long talk since. Are you, are you serious? Yeah. I did not understand a single word you're saying. Did you sustain an injury in the battle? Well, I know one thing for sure, they aren't back yet. Perhaps they stopped at an inn or took a detour. Well, we can do it out of his way. You best rest here until they return. Oh, okay. Yeah, I guess I'll do that. One look into Rosmere transformed the young King Samus into a mysterious woman named Apnea. Another look turned the dark tyrant Murdo into a second, much older King Somnus. Where could they be, and what of Captain Blade? Who they both referred to as Rusty. His numerous questions unanswered, the Chancellor endured a long, sleepless night. <laughs> Apnea, yes. And I... think she's from the real world? The plot of this game, 
as we have come to uh, come to analyze is that there were three heroes who were our first three protags from the left the three of them were all slain by the villain of the game basically the stark sorcerer killed all three of them by petrifying them and shattering them in the moment they died we woke up as a dream we are the dream created by those who die or who died so that we can save the conscious world so the dream world denizens are trying to save the waking world denizens created by a dream of the three heroes who were slain <laughs> that's the uh, that's the gist we got so far well i'm officially on my last nerve we've waited all night with no word whatsoever i have no other option but to consider them all missing i implore you search for their party in my stead or the dream of those who know the heroes. It's also true that we could be created by the dreams of the wishes of people who wish to be saved. That is also true. We don't really know who dreamed us yet. We could be collective dreams like the uh, the mother and father in the waking world, the king and queen who uh, dreamt of their son who died. It's very possible that now that he doesn't exist in the living world, he now exists in the dream world as somebody else. Hey, what's going on here, eh? Did the king say he had a reward waiting for us when we got back to the castle? And then he heads for the hills when he comes to collect. You think he's playing us for suckers? Yeah. Hey, you said it, man. Keep it down, guys. The chancellor can hear you. So, Titus? <laughs> Probably. Well, I'm officially on my last nerve. We have waited all night. I have no word whatsoever. I have no other option but to consider them all missing. I implore you search for their party in my set. We best keep the season secret. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Let's go to Somnia in the other world. Wait, that's it. I think I get what's going on. The king told us to come to his castle, right? Oh, right. The other castle. Yeah, I was just thinking that. Right. He said, come to my castle. He didn't mean the castle of the dreaming world, so he was able to go back to the waking world. All right. Well, that makes me even more curious. Because... We were in a plane above this one before we fell? Now, the holes that opened up, are those the connections to the dreaming world? Or to the waking world? That opened up in the dream? I have to, like, stare at the map. Yeah, it's a completely different layout, period. So something happened that caused the holes that allowed the dreams to enter reality. Alright, let's see what's up with Apnea. Now that song stuck in my head. I know you lot, aren't you the troll who scammed their way into the castle? Yeah. I thought as much have been waiting for you to make another appearance march this way. It's you, the famed fakers. I hope you'll enjoy playing dress up in the dungeon. Damn. Thanks to your shameful, shamery, and flagrant flim flammery, Captain Rusty has. Did he really kill himself? Did, did he get fired or did he kill himself? Wait up. Rusty? Is he dead? Oh my god. Get in there, chop chop. King Samus wants to grill you later to get to the bomb of why you would impersonate his son. Until then, you're going to sit there and think about what you've done. Poor Rusty. 
Oi, can you hear me? It's your new neighbor. So you're faking all along? I knew there was something dodgy about you a lot. What I want to know is how they managed to catch you. Don't tell me you just gave yourselves up. Okay. You think they'll take me to court? <laughs> no, hey. I'm innocent, I tell you. What? I'm terribly sorry, should never have locked you up. Please find your hearts to forgive me. When I told King Sun as you're in custody, he screamed at me to bring you to him right away. I can't work out just what's going on. Who in the world are you? But there's no time for that. An audience with King Sun is away to you. Why Ashlyn? She wasn't involved in that tomfuckery. <laughs> I don't know, she's with them. <laughs> tomfuckery. I apologize for my guard's incompetence. It was not my intention that you should be incarcerated here. I've heard the tale of how you disguise yourself as my son, and yes, I see now that the resemblance is striking, uncanny, in fact. In my dreams, too, there was one that looked like you, the one who saved me. Okay, so the reason why these two were sleeping... Oh, you know what? Okay, so the reason why these two were sleeping was because there was a monster who was the king in the dreaming world and the king who never slept was the queen because he did say that early on he never sleeps so those two were like nightmares or like dreams that weren't supposed to be there yeah they're nightmares that trap them yeah I've summoned you here to humbly ask you to lie to me. I want to know the truth. In my dreams, I was Mordal. And someone came before me standing side by side with my queen. Was this really you? It was you. I knew it. Yet now you stand before me in the flesh. I no longer know where my dreams end and where reality begins. Oh, okay. Dragon Quest V though. Probably, I don't know. I didn't play a DS version. Remember that fateful day like it was yesterday. I was aboard the fleetest vessel. The time of the final battle of Mordal was at hand. And without warning, I was enveloped in illusions, engulfed in confusion. <laughs> I love that people just drop dead in this game. I return to my castle, I don't know. But when I wake, I know it was too terrible to recall. And if you ask me, it's kind of an improvement. I had somehow became Murda. Bro got bitch slapped by glitter. Man. <laughs> it was you who saved me from that nightmare. It is to you whom I owe everything. If it were not for your courage, I would still exist as Murdom. And as Murdom, I would still be inflicting untold pain and suffering on the residents of that dream world. I haven't got a single game in this series where there is not transformation as some sort of story element. <laughs> Every single one. Yeah, we are on six. I'm sorry, I'm still adjusting to this new reality. I must go outside to feel the cool breeze on my face. Hey, LZ. Good evening, good evening. How you doing? And when I came to my horror, I realized that I got isekai to him. Please. Hey, should I forget that night my gravely injured husband was carried back to the castle. The night I had a terrifying dream. I saw the inhabitants of the dream world groaning under Mordal's oppression just as in our world. But in my dream, I felt the most peculiar sensation when I gazed at Mordal. I didn't understand it, but now I believe I have sensed the anguish of my husband, helpless and trapped in that evil form. I felt myself being sucked into that dream world deeper and deeper, so deep I could not escape. When I became King Somnus in that world, I have not the faintest idea. The mystery still weighs on my mind. All I know is that the mercy and the grace of the goddess, I am myself once more. And of course, I am forever indebted to you, Calzone. Oh, uh, sounds like you're playing all Dragon Quest games, will you be playing Dragon Quest spin-off games? Uh, if, if I'm being totally honest... I don't have really any desire to play the uh, spin-offs. 
I mostly just want to play the mainline games because they're long enough as is, but also they're the ones that I was always the most interested in. If there is any of them I am interested in looking at would be um, uh, Dragon Quest Heroes purely because I'm a big Mojo fan. But um, for the most part, uh, Dragon Quest, uh, I'm mostly just interested in playing through the stories of the main games. Ten included. But yeah. First of all, mentioned for a while. Oh yeah, that's true. <laughs> this world of dream and you were in their dreams as well? I think this is the real world of waking world. <laughs> I think it is. I think it is. <laughs> yeah, my nose. Is the king down in the cr Oh, no, there you are. Thanks for joining me. My only concern now that I'm awake is, well, I'm sure that you can guess. It is Murdo alone who occupies my thoughts. Thank to your courage, he's been banished from the dream world. In this world, he's very much alive and well, and his power's growing. If we do not strike soon, this world will fall into his clutches. That's the thought that haunts me. Yet there's no cause for despair. We still have time. I do have one request to make of you. I'd like you to go into my stead and do battle with Murdo. Blessed as you are of the ability to travel between worlds, you may be able to withstand Murdo's illusion and fuckery. Will you take on this heavy burden of this mission? The entire kingdom of Somnia will stand beside you. I mean, yeah, sure, I guess. I'm delighted to hear it. I sense that you would not let me down. But I'm afraid that we no longer have a ship capable of transporting our troops to the battlefield. Yet there's no cause for despair. Have you ever heard of the sacred village of Ghent? No, I don't think. I'll take the word for it, Slevness. I still ain't gonna watch it, though. Hey, good morning, kitty. How you doing? Mr. Aaron, it seems like you like Pokemon. <laughs> I recommend Dungeon Quest Monster Side Games. <laughs> uh, I'm, ac I'm actually a very big fan of Mystery Dungeon. Um, I want to say I played the Torneco one for a short period a good time ago. Uh, but I played... Um, i played a bit of uh, Shiren the Wanderer, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Chocobo, uh, Etrian. Uh, I haven't played too many of the Dragon Quest ones, though. I only played a little bit of one of them a long time ago. Maybe at some point, though, I do like Mystery Dungeon. Devoted to Sermon, the Goddess People of Ghent possess a sacred ship known as the Providence. Go to Ghent and show the authorities the royal missive I have prepared for you. We sure to give you free use of the Providence. I have the ship. Oh. Oh, that's not the ship I put in my bag. Okay, just check it. The second village of Ghent lies in the mouse to the north. I've ordered the checkpoint. Oh, that damn place. Okay. Alright. Got it. Insomnia and sleep apnea. What a pain. Right? Oh, shit. Oh, no, that works. Go save again. Oh, oh my neck. Oh, it feels good, but Jesus. Ooh. All right. Do I name my firstborn son testicular torsion? Scare the shit out of him his entire life. You know? I feel like that's like power word kill. I feel like it only make him stronger. What if Johnny Test's full name is Johnny Testicular? What if that's like short for something? Maybe I just can't say it. Okay. Johnny Testicular Torsion. Okay. Up I go. Down again. Too more vile than the show already is. <laughs> God. Do you really mean it? Okay. Let me go up to the right. Okay. Whatever you say. Uh, yeah, just don't use magic. Don't use magic. Set to kill. Now we go. Power word HRT because of the damn mirror. 
god. Imagine teachers in the middle of roll call. Testicular torsion! I think it would scare everyone around him. Either say village of Gen head east to the river and fall it north to the mountains. You'll find Gen resting just past where the river ends. The population there believes itself to be especially favored by the goddess. They're not always easy to deal with. Okay. Got it. East the river and then follow it north. Got it. <laughs> now the little guys. I really, really don't like the little puff balls there. Okay. Alright. Okay. Oh. That was easy. Welcome, pilgrims, again. The blessings of the goddess be upon you. If the winding path of destiny has brought you here, then surely it was meant to be. Yeah, yeah. Uh. Hey, Spacey, would you support me if I legally changed my name to Shadow the Hedgehog? You know, I'd be more, more worried about, like, I don't know, Sega coming after you, so, you know, I'd actually, you know, I'd talk with you. Make sure that you know what you're getting into. I don't want you getting any, like, you know, trouble legal actions or anything like that, but, you know, if it's allowed, then, yeah, sure. Please, Sega would love me, do you think? Would your middle name be The? Go on, gobble it up, that's right. What's a fee in the cattle and tang to my husband? I don't have a single solitary second to myself. Showing a gratitude to Goss is well and good, but how about showing some gratitude to me once in a while? Spirit of gratitude indeed, sometimes I wish I'd never left my village to come here. Oh, Jesus. Cows live inside? Where am I going? Oh, hey, weapons. What you got? Ooh, cautery sword! Hell yeah. Uh, morning star. Attacks a whole group of enemies at once. Ashland can use that. Really? That's really good, actually. Wow. Um, Millie can use the cautery sword. Oh shit. Okay. I was not aware she could use swords. Shit. Let's give that to Millie. Alright. Do the Rusty's fate? Uh, yeah, from the ones that we did talk to. He just sounded like Rusty off himself. Need to get absolutely jacked. Then I support you in this. Hey, gaze upon the sacred abode, for this is where our elder resides. More holy man than you will not meet. You can go and have a poke around if you like. Just don't rearrange the furniture or anything. Have people gone in there just to rearrange the furniture before? What have you seen? Hey! By the infinite unknowable wisdom of the goddess, you found your way here. Desire not ease with me, I take it? Yeah, I guess so. Now, patience is not a virtue that the goddess has granted me an infinite supply of. What precisely was it that you wanted? Uh huh. Galzone adds the royal missive to the Elder. So thanks to the divine will, the goddess, King Samus, has awoken and not before time. But no sooner does he await for a request that he be given for use of our sacred ship. This is no trifling demand, is there not a perfectly good ship at the castle? I mean, you know, I'm the one that, you know, saved you, so... Saved him, so, you know, I mean, I should have a boat, not the goddess. As the goddess moves in mysterious ways, so too it seems does King Somnus. This request may have come directly from the king, but our people answer only to the goddess herself. I cannot land you the ship, please accept my apologies, but your journey has been in vain. Thanks. Oh. Was what I saw in the comment, though? 
Well, somebody said that he threw himself upon his own sword. A pointy hat. Okay. And then some guy started crying. There we go. Pointy hat. Okay, this is for nobody. Alright. Oh, hey. Grandfather, I have returned. Nice hat. <gasps> A pointy hat. Nevin, you're back. How are your studies progressing? I have to feel that I should be offering lessons to the teachers. This is it should be. I've schooled you well, for the destiny that awaits you is no ordinary one. May I ask who these visitors are? They don't look much in view of the spirit of the goddess. Well, you don't look like hot shit yourself. They brought a missive from King Somnus of Somnia. Request the use of our most sacred ship, the Providence. But surely you cannot count it's allowing these vagabonds to treat the ship as their own. Do not fear, my child. I told them in no uncertain terms that the ship will not become their plaything. I take it then you have no more business here? Do you think it would be rude to ask you to leave? Ugh. The lights! Oh! We're doing the petrify thing again. What the fuck? Devin, can you hear me? It is you whom I seek. You must not send these visitors away for your destiny lies. Is this the goddess or whoever the fuck that was in the beginning of the game? Like the very beginning of the game? Together, you must embark on a voyage to the Isle of Murdal, bro of the Providence. Thank you, Jesus. Nevin, what is it, my child? What is it that afflicts you? It has been decided we must allow our visitor. <laughs> Sorry, that's just really fucking funny. <laughs> There's no way all these people look like little shitheads. I'll never let them use my boat. Nevin, don't be a dick. Father, I am leaving on an adventure. <laughs> that is really funny. But why the sudden change of heart? It's not like you. A higher power made the decision, not I. The god has deigned to speak to me. Wait, this can only mean that the visitors stand before us are the heroes spoken of in legend? Indeed, that may be so, but it's impossible for us to know. All I know is we must break the seal and return the providence to the ocean. What'll happen beyond that, only the goddess knows, but I must witness it with my own eyes. I must go. <laughs> Daddy, chill. <laughs> Please. The goddess has spoken, and it's not in your power to ignore her divine voice when it calls. You cannot stand your way, I've seen how your power has grown, and I know the heavens have their own plans for you. This motherfucker's gonna be lower than the rest of the party, isn't he? Go, my child, it's time to break the seal, it's time for the promise to set sail once more. This motherfucker is going to be lower level than the rest of us. Come, it is time for us to go. We must head to the shrine where the providence awaits us. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> he might use wind magic. <laughs> Got it to my head. Blessed Nevin, the chosen one, you have come. You say the seal must be broken, the promise must sink the seas again. If you say it must be done, then so it must. Please proceed to the shrine. We should have really just walked up to them and said, God told us we could have your boat. We really should have just done that. Hey. I've awaited the day when the Providence would sail again. That, oh, that is a pretty boat. We're gonna lose it, aren't we? Once the seal is broken, the Providence will be lowered directly into the river below. Are you ready to break the seal and set sail? Yeah, I guess. Very well, it's time for us to embark on our quest. Our destinies are entwined. Thanks, Nevin. Not that enthusiastic about you joining. They'll take too long.
Devin closes his eyes and begins to pray. Oh, goddess, since ancient times, the people of Gen have served us as your most faithful vassals. Now that I break the sacred seal of the providence, I pray that you will gift us wind in our sails. Devotior mersu votaro instiator. Oh, goddess, hear my prayer. You better learn Zing. You better learn Zing, you better learn Kazing. If you're if you're worshipping the goddess, you better have a revive. So help me, God. We are so tiny pixels right now. Oh, the goddess is pissed! Okay. Sorry for doubting you. You're dramatic. It's a long way down. It's so long, it's going from the top right of the screen to the middle of the screen. Better be a nice boat. I mean, it looks like a nice boat. This seems... Oh, that was loud. That's not good. That That's not a good... Oh, you lowered it down just to make it slide down rivets? Oh! Oh! Oh, something's gonna tear! Oh! Oh. Okay. Yeah, that, that's, that's, that was safe. That was very good for the boat. Couldn't, couldn't the goddess have just lifted us down into the water? What's up, boats? It made such a loud f- it, 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 The boats are lowered in the water by descending of holy light? Oh, there's rugs on the surface, actually. Yeah, wait a second. Up, by the way. Hey, thanks. We arrived at the Isle of Murdoe. Shall we get going, then? Oh, and I think I better stay here. Hey, came all this way just to quit now? No, no, there's no need to force her. Besides, best that someone remains of the ship. Ashley, keep watch over the Providence for us, okay? You got it. Started to drop out like this. Oh, by the way, do you want me to put my gear in the bag for you? Are you really leaving? Okay, you got it. What the fuck is this? Oh my god, he's lower than the rest of the party, you... Gentile prodigy. What do you do? Oh, he's just- oh, he's a straight-up white mage. He has poof, mid-heal, heal, squelch, woo. He is wind, he's winded healing. Oh, but not being too much of a pain, you are. <laughs> of something. I want to be silly. <laughs> Does the boat come with me? The boat comes with me. All right. Okay. Sure. 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 All right. Um, let's think of a party layout then. We have a white mage now. We have a white mage. We have a black mage. We have a cleric. I kind of want to take her. Honestly, I kind of want to take all three of these. So I guess the real question is, do I want a black mage or a white mage? Do I want damage or do I want more healing? I think I have to take Nevon for the time being, because uh, I'm sure he might be important for something. Okay. Oh, it's going to do the whole anime. Okay. <laughs> All right. Shove him overboard. Shove Nevon overboard. God. It's like you could shove him overboard. He ain't that tall. 
We arrived at the Isle of Murdao. Hold down the fort, okay? All right, I see. I see, okay. Is that another boat? What the fuck? Oh, yeah, there is another boat, but it's kind of fucked. This place is dead, eh? There's another ship here that means somebody else besides us must have made it onto the island. Yeah. Ow. I love that there's just that little bit of extra fuck you juice, like, right before you go in. Alright. Ooh, one of those things. Uh, never. I, I, get, well, I guess, what do you do? I guess don't use magic for now. Fuddle. Grimace shake tiles, please! Oh, okay. Easy life, easy game. There's a chest. Out of that lava, but I cannot walk safely into that. Hell, Nino! Fuck. Uh, let's see. Make an appearance in Monsters 1. Yeah, I saw a lot of the, or some of the spin-offs have like different care, different pro tags from the series, but like aged down. I did notice that. Fire clouds? Yeah. Not that shake tasted like blueberry cheesecake. Tasted like cereal to me. Hard to explain, but the Grimace shit kind of tasted like cereal. Anybody else who can use it as well? Oh, Nevin can use that. No shit. Nevin can use that carver and I can use that. Let's give that to Nevin. Nevin can wield full plate. Okay. Never had the Grimace Shake or the memes about it though. Yeah, I had it once. It was, again, very, tasted like cereal. It was kind of weird. Thumbnado bat. Okay. There's a lot of XP in here. Okay. All right. Honestly, the first three characters are all really good. I don't think I have a... Unless somebody, like, really interesting comes along, I don't really think I have a reason to get rid of them. The newest Dragon Quest Monster game is a prequel to 4. So I've heard. Ugh, <laughs> uh, yeah. That's why they're called Hell Nino, because... Hot as hell. Something like that. Okay. Boom, 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 boom. Aha! A chain whip. Can anyone utilize this appropriately? Nevin does use whips, okay. Mm. 
That's good as me think that Dungeon Master treasure insects. <laughs> Might be a similar concept. Yay, Carver gained a level. Ugh. Okay. Hmm. Now, so playing these games is like generally really chill for me. Like, I don't know, playing these is just kind of relaxing, you know what I mean? I mean, I do like playing, like, you know, spooky, really stressful games, but... Yeah, that's nice just, like, to have something I can not really turn off my brain, but something I can just kind of, like, chill out with, you know what I mean? Heart's not pumping as much. Well, until certain things happen, but... No, no, it's nice. Also, there's a lot of goodie bags on this... Place, Jesus. Thanks, Absol. Never looking at that pile of golden gems without thinking, damn, that looks tasty. God, I genuinely cannot wait for the next episode. Oh, I'm really excited for Dungeon Meshi. I say that, I still gotta catch up on free and. Oh, God, I can't stop yawning now. How is it already 5 o'clock? Sit back to a lax sound again. Eh, sorta. Of. Dragon Quest is still really hard at times, but it's pretty chill for the most part. Flames burst from the blade. Oh, is that what the uh, sword mill is using? I forgot that was the activation. Millie's got a fancy AoE magic spell. Nice. Nice. was so good this week. Oh, I'm I'm still really behind. I'm very late on the bandwagon there. I think I'm on like episode uh, like 13 now. Like right when that uh, when that priest joins up, that's about where I'm at. Absolutely adore that episode too, by the way. Like a weasel or floats all night. Weasel. Float cells, they have, uh, they, they got more tum. <laughs> Among other things. You can tell by the face markings. You love the moment? Yeah, Tyson? Yeah, Tyson? Yo, your, your award is a trip to hell! Does he say tongue? Tum. Belly. Thick. This is the... This is not the right way. I have no idea where I'm going. I have... No clue where I'm going. Carver keeps gaining MP, and I want to know what that's for eventually. <laughs> Sorry, it's been a week. Ah, you're good. No worries. No worries. I yawn all the time. You gotta apologize for being sleepy. Ugh, I yawn all the damn time. Ugh, I'm doing it again. Hi, God. Ugh. Wow. Oh, wow. That's a big stat up. Oh, my God. Never learned fizzle. Okay. Okay, okay. Well, yeah, this cave is rather complicated. You must take care of it to get lost. So-called free thinkers, and they think about yawning. You will now all yawn. <laughs> God. The <laughs> looking sack. I can assure for you, I am not sackless. But you know, it, you know, it saves up on the you know the real the real estate. Oh, I can't go in there. All right. Who the fuck am I? Well, at least it's XP for Nevin, but where the fuck am I? Bum, 
Down in my head. Ow. Everything hurts. Huh. There's another back on you're in hell. It's cozy here. Now I wonder, what was that thing? It can also be used as a tool during battle. During battle. Right. Now I wonder... If you're a healer... Oh, yeah. Uh... Let me try that. Rude. Aha! That's what I thought. You're a little heal bot. Alright, okay. Infinite healing rod? Infinite healing rod. Hmm. Hey, that's really good, actually. Wow. Wow, that's really good. Damn. And having it basically just help us get through this dungeon and get some free farming out of it, too. That's a lot of gold. How much damage does that lava actually do? Not much, okay. And sometimes Devil will cast Whoosh. Huh. Why I do that? Kind of digging these guys. It's a good god that they have like... No, I guess the legs aren't that big, just kind of looks big where they're standing. It kind of looks like they just have one big ass. It's a weird angle. Why do you stand like that? Oh god, hell Nino. Because it's fucking hot wind. Yes! <laughs> I love it. Oh, man. Ugh. Oh, God, the audio ever shot. You. Change of tactics. Change of tactics, everybody. Kill. Oh. Well, yeah, well, you know. Okay. Oh, metal slimes. I swear they're taking years off my life. Okay. Don't use magic except for you. Use your staff thing. That is a lot of time. Okay. Okay, alright. Uh, and there's nothing down here. That leads up to that one spot. You boom 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 boom. we go. Let's walk this way. That's where I came from, I'm pretty sure. Oh yeah, they're currently working on Dragon Quest 10, or 12. It got announced, um, some time ago, though. Alongside uh, the Dragon Quest 3 uh, remake. So, don't know when that's ever coming out. Because we've had, like, no updates since. I feel like it was announced a little too soon. Just a bit. Hmm. 
I am lost in this place. Right. As of December 2023, they announced they started playtesting the Dragon Quest 3 remaster. Oh, really? Again, didn't I? I'm just gonna go. Not sure there's anything else on this floor. Alright. Okay. At least, um, at least I'm getting plenty of XP before, uh, fighting Murdell. At least I'm doing okay. Nevin's level 12. Good for him, I guess. Where is this? It's a dead end with a chest. Not what I was hoping for, but... More than what I expected. Ugh. Ugh, I'm stretching. Ugh. Oh god. Thanks. This party's honestly already feeling pretty strong. The fact that we have an infinite heal staff already. God, if we get shattered again, it would be really funny. Awful, but funny. What was that? Seed of Life. Okay. Yeah. Use it on Hero. Keep getting his stats higher and higher. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, dun, dun, dun. I finally found a place where to go and I just hit a dead end. I was about to accounts of our JRPG structure game, but then I realized it's just Metopia. I like to make faces, don't you? Metopia seemed cute. Well, I'd be willing to actually try it at some point. <laughs> oh god. I really gotta stop yawning. No, it's because I woke up really, really early today. Like, really, really early? I think I was awake, like, around 3 p.m. Uh, did I come up that? I'm not really sure. Every time you build up your prior, everything falls apart, your problems get taken, you have to pick a new class. Is that what happens in Metopia? Facebook up while the sun was still shining. It was awful. It was terrible. It was horrible. Giant Sinister. I believe it was of Jay. It was a long, it was a long time ago, actually. I watched him play, but I was also like half coherent and and dead. Is this eating Borg at 3 a.m. again? It was 3 p.m. Thank you. Is there nothing down here? Oh, fuck off. <laughs> God. Mm. Okay, how about now? Oh, 
Uh, do, 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 I, do I sound decent? Much better good? Hey. All right. Trevor's level 18. He's getting a lot of stats. Oh, my God. Four barons. The hell is that? Four barons. Right, it's not listed under magic. Right, 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 right. Am I... I need to be squelched. Thank you, Jesus. Okay. Four barons. I guess I can't really check. Oh, odd. Yeah, his attack's really high. Everything's just really high with him. The only thing I got higher is wisdom and agility and whatever the fuck style is. Oh man. Oh, really quick, actually, I'm gonna use the washroom and probably grab, uh, probably grab some sort of uh, caffeinated beverage or maybe just a drink period to inhale something into my face so i will be right back and if you have any questions feel free to ask loaf use this opportunity to obtain consumables of your own perishing is uh not a good thing so i will be right back
Alright, hello, hello, good evening. Yeah. I'm sitting down, stretching, I'm cracking my everything involving my body. <laughs> Scram is the 5 0. How in what way? How in what way? Am I the 5 0? Okay, get on the floor. <laughs> okay, there we go. All right, I'm good. I'm situated. I'm alive. All is well. <laughs> chat, scatter the chat, managed to escape, please. What do y'all run? What have, I, what have I? What have I done to make you just run away in fear, eh? The single chat members were over the 10,000 XP, but we always managed to run. Oh shit, you're worth 10,000 XP? Huh. I'll use this knowledge for the future. It's the fuzz, God. Hey! Okay. Smite him. I hate you. Uh... Why must I suffer? Hey, Insamakara. Good evening. Hope you're doing well. Okay. Face these XP vanishing the distances ever. Man! <laughs> oh, is that so, Volpes? Because it always seems like y'all are up to, like, you know, some kind of, like, crime or something. Mods that replace all slimes to random chatters. <laughs> like, change the name of it.
you. He's staying! He's staying! Get him! Oh my god. Oh! 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 Oh, please. Oh, Nevin, you suck! Oh! Oh! Ah! Woo! <laughs> Alright. I'm content. Calzone gained a level. That chat member chose poorly. Man. Just have like a giant roulette. Whenever I see a metal slime, I just have a giant roulette wheel on screen of every single chat member. If the slime dies, they get banned for the day. <laughs> they get timed out. There we go. Let's fucking banish the Shadow Realm. Okay. Definitely like Dragon Quest 7 or something. Having gained a level. Oh, he did learn Zing! I knew it. I knew it. Can read it on you. Where the fuck do I go in this place? Oh. There we go. <laughs> Boom. Okay, kill Chamber and ask why we scatter. <laughs> oh man. Okay. Let's grab that first. Showed up in the spooky aura. Oh, they're vulnerable to magic now. That's weird. Ooh! Okay. Look at that sexy crib. Alright, let's go grab this item up here. Oh! You again. Don't do it, don't do it, don't- Oh! Oh, it's like that. Huh. Alright. That was one agility for that seed, okay. You for Mimic? Yeah, Cannabox is the weaker version of the Mimic. The Mimic comes later. I'm slightly upset at how useful Nevin is. Malevolent lamps and mudslinger. I think it's dead. <gasps> oh, oh, they have whack. Oh, that's bad. I'll take that. It's a 
things suck. God, the mudslingers are cursed. Uh, yeah. Alright, cool. Uh, let me throw a heal at, uh, Nevin while we go. Even a heal staff is nice, though. We gotta be alive to use it. Hey, dead guy. There's no response. It's just a corpse. Big surprise. Curves knee just retractable. You're gonna do a lot of flying knees. Ah, uh, he doesn't really shoot his knee off. I didn't sound glad enough for the corpse to hear you. What am I, a priest? That staff of Gent is like doing a lot of work. Is the heal staff out of battle? No. You have to be in combat. Once you're threatened, the magic will activate. Dems the rules. Animated armor. <laughs> okay. All right. Let's get up out of here. Ooh. Okay. Ah. There's a lot of enemies down here that really want to use whack. I'd say it's early, but we're already level 18. That's pretty good. That's pretty far in Dragon Quest terms. Okay. More agility, please. Oh. No, don't use the here. Uh, okay. Up here and around. This is a priest when he's supposed to like a... <laughs> Said I'm not a priest. You know, that being said, I would totally work it. I would totally work the, the whole holy robes like this. Is that sacrilegious? Ah. A. Billy's level is 17. Okay. Uh, I can go up there, but I think there's something to the right. I'm worried about bumping into more of the mudslingers, though. Uh. So Carver is 18 now. What, are you serving gods or serving gods? <laughs> Please. I definitely serve. Is it down here? Nope, there's nothing. Just as- Oh my god! Get me the fuck out of here. Er, well, I guess I could- That was a bad idea. Oh, please only have mana for one. <gasps> oh! You pay. Oh. Oh. All right. Jesus. Carver's level 19. All right. That monster hand a loaf of book of whack instruction. Should we be worried? Yes. Yes, wrong. Uh, okay. Let's heal Millie a bit. Heal myself a bit. I got three healers in the party, actually. I'd ask if that was a bit much, but honestly, healing is really, really useful in these games, so... I 
And I feel like me and Carver are enough damage. Honestly, Millie does good damage if you give her a good weapon. I didn't even know she could do damage until I gave her that thing. She's really, really strong. She, I, for some reason, didn't think she was going to be a regular cleric. Okay. Thinking here she's going to be like the white mage, then in comes Nevin. Yeah, Ooh. Rude. Oh, going to be squelched again. Thank you, Millie. You will the evil creepy coast that's summer closing on murder. I'm not that way, clearly. Yeah, ba -da -doo. Millie seems like a red mage, though. She's cleric. She has, um... Uh... I, I think she can wear tank. Yeah, she's wearing tanky gear. She's wearing the, uh... Enchanted armor. She has a big fuck-off sword. I actually don't know if she can use a shield or if she needs a specific type of shield. Now, red mage... Red mages are not really good at anything. They're just kind of okay at everything. Priests in, uh... Priests in Dragon Quest, they're tanky, they can heal, they've got good physical damage, usually some offensive magic. They're kind of a little bit all over the place, but honestly, they're a lot better than Red Mages. <laughs> much, much better than Red Mage. This is uncanny. There's something sacred about this place. It says the goddess is watching over us. You must rest here tonight under her watchful and most merciful get. Oh shit, this is the start of the game. Oh, shit. But we have Nevin now. Well, shit. Trouble sleeping? Yeah. It's only natural. The time's almost at hand, after all. Now, where'd he get to? He went to check the path ahead, but that was some time ago. Yeah, this is the intro of the game. Oh my god. Ahoy, are you three done sawing logs? I was out scouting, ain't no doubt about it. This is definitely the place, but... But what? You look somewhat puzzled. What is it? I know, I can't shake the feeling we've been down this road before. Ah, no point friend over it, though. You get enough rest, it's high time we shove off. He's right. We got nothing to gain from dallying here. With the grace of the goddess, we've traveled far to get here. Now our goal's in sight. We must press on. Let's do this, Calzone. The Dread Fiend ain't gonna defeat himself. So this was the big bad they were trying to kill in the beginning of the game. The fate of the world rests on this battle. If we can emerge victorious, peace will be restored. We're as ready as we'll ever be. Come on, Calzone. We must go. You seem troubled. Are you too haunted by memories of this place? Yeah. It's puzzling, but perhaps it's not our place to understand. Only the goddess knows the truth. Well, we better go. Our destiny awaits us. Oh my. It's literally, let's do this all over again, but this time let's bring a white mage. Wow, yeah, this really is just the intro. Murdoch keeps awaiting us at the bottom of this precipice, but how do we descend safely? I know I've been here before. Maybe it's de la vu, deja bru. My imagination. But I'm through with thinking. I got more important stuff to worry about right now. We beat the sky and peace is restored. Zoma breathing heavily in the core. <laughs> I swear to God, if they pull a Zoma. They are. This isn't even close to the end of the game. The final leg of our journey awaits us. If the legends are true, all that remains is to play this ocarina. Yes, just like before. But here goes nothing. Well, now I'm bonus confused, because I thought this would be, like, the end of the game. 
but we're like... There's, there's no way we're even close. It's so interesting to see all this, like, make sense when you watch the intro initially, and it just kind of doesn't, really. It's just like, oh, three adventures, then shit happens, and then summon dragon! Imagine if she fucked up the toss and it fell off the ledge, right? Oh, man. No, not Nimzo. No Nimzo! No Mildrath! Get that shit out of here! I don't want to see Zoma, Mildreth, Nimzo, I don't want to see any of their faces, holy shit. Did the original heroes die at the middle-ish of their journey? I guess so, they did, yeah. Well, fighting this guy is supposed to be the end. Oh, sweet, the lone hero. Thank you for following, I appreciate it. Welcome to the Null Patrol, my alerts are a little screwy tonight. Nevin, do you know how to protect from petrification without asking for any reason? <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Alright. Seems we have no other choice but to keep moving forward. Lead the way, Calzone. What's the matter with this door? It's the only one that joined no keel. Small trick, guy. Eh? Maybe we have beat Murdon or to break the illusion, just saying. Only well, the goddess knows the perils lie ahead. For our protection, I'll place a sacred barrier here. And we close his eyes and mouths a silent prayer. Ah! Now, whatever may befall us, we will always be able to return to this location. That's probably just for, like, zoom. It's probably, like, a way to heal here, most likely. Oh, hey. Neat. I see. Let me some drag quests for your playing boards, but just keep an eye to keep up on it. <laughs> I have all the, uh, the previous playthroughs uploaded as VODs here. Uh, let's see. I am planning on going through all of them at the end of the day. Uh, give that to me. I would love that defense. Please and thank you. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Huh? Oh, I'm stupid. Okay. Ugh. All right. There. Dragon Quest 4 is a very nostalgic favorite of mine. Dragon Quest 4, I absolutely adored. Like, the entire time I was having just nothing but fun with it. I love Dragon Quest 4. What's that? Oh, shit. Really? Calzone, a vest. Calzone, you gotta see this. It looks like me. Is he dead? He sure ain't moving. No, he ain't dead, just sleeping like the dead. Why is there a double of me in this joint here of all places? So he is the dream of the real. What's happening to. Oh? Oh, the dream just merged into the real thing. What's going on here, Crikey, old on? It's all flooding back to me. The name's Carver. Carver. I'm a carpenter's son from Port Haven. Best in the business, too. Did our Carver just die? Well, I mean, like, he's gone. In that case. Anyway, that dreary town wasn't really floating my boat, so I left home. That's when I fell in with Calzone. We came here to face Mardot to show him what for and everything like that. 
But as you hardly need reminding, Murdoch clobbered us and turned us to stone. My spirit got ejected straight to the dream world. Oh, his spirit. Okay. I became what I always was in my dreams, a Roman warrior with a nose for adventure. Don't listen to me ramble on about my life and time. I'm sure you get the gist. Now that I've got my trusty old body back, I feel all my strength flowing back to me. Oh! Carver learned an ability. Listen, Calzone, I can see why you don't want to think of yourself as just a figure from the dream world. I know it ain't easy to accept that at some point the person you think you are is going to disappear and everything like that. Holy shit. But don't worry, I may have returned to my real safe, but I remember all the stuff you and me have been through together. You know what that means, right? It means my dream self has disappeared after all. It's all part of me. You need to find your real body here in this world too. In the real world too, you got nothing to fear. We can continue this chat later. We got a certain dread thing to deal with first. Let's shove off. So, his subconscious didn't die. It just merged into the old one. I'm sorry, did you just take party leader from me? Oomph. Okay. I wonder. Well, he's the only real one now. Yeah? Don't forget to thank Nominate while you're at it. Shit. Shit. Ugh. Nevin is still real, yes. Alright. Nevin is absolutely real. Obviously, Nevin likes me to see you play. Hi. Well, I hope you have a good snooze. Hope you have a very good rest. You take care. The Ver Tank should be in the front. Yeah, he should. Technically, he should. Oh my god, that hurt. Nevin, thank you. That's a scary thought, though, that everyone in the dream world is unreal. But their sub their consciousness can just merge in with the old ones, so I mean, like... Galzum, wait. Merja awaits us beyond the store, I can feel it. We must keep our wits about us. I've heard it said that Madra does not hesitate to use the darks the most deceptive arts. He can fight as dark and dirty as he likes. Things are going to go the way he did like last time, believe you and me. So we stand here once more, all our steps have led us to the same place. It does indeed seem that since that dark day, we've been trapped inside one long dream. But all I've experienced in that dream world has served to make us stronger, of that I am sure. It's time. What about our statues? Not again, this happened last time. Oh. Oh, we're all being dragged around by the magic. Ah. Oh. You are persistent. I'll give you that. Such persistence deserves a monument. Stone should do the trick, don't you think? Please. Oh. Okay. All right. Okay. Galzone, what happened? Uh, what a fine brother you are, Calzone. Scaring me like that. Please? Say, hey, Calzone, would you mind coming here a moment? Pretty mirror, you betcha. You had this with you earlier. 
the weirdest thing, though. My reflection in the mirror just seems so unhappy. Stare into the mirror! You want to take a look? Galzone, gaze over Tanya's shoulder into the depths of Ra's mirror. Holy shit. Good morning, Rari. How you doing? Oh! You have Ra's mirror, do you? Upon further reflection, I suppose the same trick just won't do. You clearly will not stay banished to the Dream Realm, so I'll just have to deal with you for real. I'm fortunate for you, I'm much more powerful in reality than I ever was inside a dream. Are you ready for eternal sleep? This is a nightmare from which you shall not awaken. Oh boy. I'm going up early day? Well, hey, good morning. Okay. Show no mercy. Healing. Okay. Uh... I feel like we should focus... You know what? Let's not use our mana. Not yet. Let's just do AoE. Oh! Carver, Jesus. Ugh. Wise to his tricks and tactics? Yeah! So, so rude. Gottery sword. Yeah, yeah. That does so much damage, and that's fire breath. Ooh. I'll pump out some extra healing. There we go. Let Millie and Carver fight a bit. Oh shit, really? Fat Shenron? Yeah, a little bit. Knuckle Sandwich is good as yours is in seven. Carver's your MVP now. He was never not my MVP, so shit. Yeah, that's disgusting. All right. Huh. MVP plus. Flames burst out from the blade. Oh! <laughs> Alright, who's worse off? Uh... Nevin's pretty damn important, so let's... Let's keep him up. Okay, this turn he has to summon or strike back. Summoning fit you dodged! Ugh. Good healing. Okay. That good old AI allowing itself to change what it was going to do that turn. Uh, let's get a step ahead. Man, my healing really sucks. Ugh. I'm not amused that the armors don't arrive immediately and take a bet. Yeah? <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. I think it's because they're supposed to be stronger, but they're not really. They don't feel it to me anyways. Maybe it's because we keep doing enough damage to them. 
Jesus. Whoosh really sucks. At least on this guy. It's honestly really, really funny. Hey! What? Uh huh? Get that! <laughs> Get that the fuck out of here! <laughs> Shit. Oh my god. Let's fucking punch that little dude in the orbit. Oh my god. Okay. That. Uh, oh, there's definitely a face, too. Well, I gained a level. How could this be? I am Murda, not some cheap conjurer. These fools really hope to overpower me. And through playing games, if you wake up and realize your world belongs to me. Gah. Oh. Come, you have yet to witness the true terror. It's time to end this. Yeah, there we go. Okay. That's what I thought. Uh, okay. Let's... Now at this point, keep Millie on healing. Uh... Let's try using sap on him now, so our, uh... Oh, never mind! Okay. We have two healers active. Intense physique. Oh, I'm asleep. That's great. Oh, mm, mm. that's lightning. Dazzle. Uh, I want to try again. Okay. Bastard. You never been dazzled? That's not. Ooh. It's not the end of the world. Um, this, however, might be. Sealed Nevin. Okay. Ow. Devin's asleep, Nevin can see again. Oh. Uh. I'll heal Millie. That really, really sucks. Ugh. Okay. Ugh. Are you kidding me? Oh boy. Mm. If a car on all out, he was already on all out. Well, he was on show no mercy. This sucks. All right. Dazzled. Millie is dazzled. Nevin is dazzled. Nevin is asleep. How are you dazzling him while he's asleep? Is he asleep with his eyes open? Sucks. 
Calls for terrible lightning. God, you are a royal pain in my ass. Oof. Okay. Yeah, I'm stuck. Carver is dazzled. No, 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 he's not. Okay. That staff kicks ass, yeah, it does. Some with bang. Carver was dazzled. Uh, jeez. Here. That's what terrible lightning. It was showing on stats before. I don't know why it's not doing it now. That weird. Nevin is asleep. Uh, of course he is. Okay. Uh, yo, Millie. Ow. 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 <gasps> That's so bad. Wow, that was horrendous. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh... One after the other like that was awful. Carver's asleep. Oh, of course you put him to sleep. Ow. Ow. Carver is asleep again. Ugh. Carver is still asleep. And that's it. Ugh. Not right. Well. Shit. Where am I? Oh god. Let me just, um... Where am I? Yeah, yeah, revive him. The boomerang couldn't save you that time? It could not. Jeez, that was brutal, though. Oh my god. Yep, resurrect everybody else. How does you put a dream to sleep? That's like some existential shit. He just like throws you back into the dream world and just like resets you kind of thing. I'm guessing. Okay. Resurrect Millie, resurrect Nevin. Millie did not come back with all of her mana. No, I guess Carver didn't even use any of his mana. Ugh. Okay. Let me save. 
Find the other two buys in the dungeon? Maybe. I had multiple times with Harboss and 8, this is common. Oh, yeah, I know. Uh, this isn't the first time, it ain't gonna be the last. Alright. Let's how is this. Oh, hey, the boat. Oh, I'm in the. I'm like right here. Okay. Uh, maybe I can like check and see if there's anything useful to buy. Maybe weaponry. Okay, what do you got? Battery sword is so much better. Nevin. Didn't I buy Nevin the Morning Star? Am I going crazy? Steel broadsword for Carver. Uh, items. No, he's he's got the chain whip. That's what it is. He's using the chain whip. Okay. Iron helmets. Silver tiara. Iron shield. Actually, one of these each would be very good. Uh, Cloak of Evasion. It's not have any special effects, full plate armor. It is just better armor. Okay. Two iron shields. Let's have Carver equip one. Uh, let's buy another plate armor. Oh, I bought two. Okay. Uh, and there we go. Okay. Let's do that. Let's give that shield to you. That. <gasps> I'm not on yet. I'm not on eight yet. What's this pointy hat even do? Okay. All right. I want to give that another try. Uh, I want to give that another shot. Ugh. Alright. The leave us space. I beat Drag I beat Dragon Quest 2. I can't be scared anymore. Okay. Ba -ba -ba -dum. Ba -ba -ba -dum. Alright, down to try and find where the fuck that thing was again. Uh, no magic. Except for you. Do that. Well, if anything, we're higher level now. Jesus. Not about fear, it's about being annoyed by the RNG of pain. Uh, yeah, it sounds like Dragon Quest 2. Yeah, dum, ba -dum, ba -dum. Can you drop like a fast travel point or something in the castle? You know what? He totally did. Though the XP would be still nice. Okay. But um, but um, but um. Uh, 
let's see. Zoom. Oh, son of a bitch. Whoop. Okay, there's that path up. I already went up. Nothing to the left. <laughs> it didn't seem that big, but there's got to be something else here. Frizzle. You suck. God, that staff's so good, though. is now level 20. It's a lot of good stats again. Shit. Good morning. Hey, good morning, Gilpod. How you doing? Oh, there's... Okay, there's other stuff down here. Got it. Yeah, let's explore these before we actually get to the boss. Just woke up. Hey, welcome to the world of living. Statue? Oh! The statue is aggressive. A sculptress? Alright. Whatever you say. Oh! Shit. A snooze? Oh shit, that worked on everybody. You suck. Mm. Oh. Okay. Snooze into ice breath. Throwing hands could be a powerful option, just saying. Okay. Well then, uh, boomerang. Never ask for like a dragon quest, the game hears you and will spite you like Monster Hunter. <laughs> Alright, Millie's level 18. Kabuff. Oh, that's good. That's really good. Another one? Sure, why not? How many boss Vegas have we had so far? Uh, I mean, if you count the prologue, two? The same guy? Boom, 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 boom. Bum, ba -da 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 -da. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh, man. This guy. Rude. Devin is level 15. That yeah, was definitely, uh, definitely worth coming down here. We're getting some more XP, some more levels. Whatever the fuck's going on in here. Yeah, I missed, like, the entire rest of the dungeon. Okay, I see. Sure, Volpez. Ooh! They are. <sighs> Get that little bastard out of here! You'll never replace Healy. Not in my heart and not ever.
Now okay. Boom. There's another statue in the middle of the floor. I guess I can just beat the shit out of them. Why not? Why not? It's XP. I love recovering hero and Millie's body seems optional. Yeah, those aren't important. <laughs> Maybe they just don't want to wake up. Ooh. How is it? How have we been live for six hours so far? Good God. Okay. Hello again. Are their bodies even here, or is this just more loot? Oh shit! Oh shit! Can we have that crit lock during the boss? Jesus, Carver! Okay! What's in the chest? Besides pain. What luck? A fire claw. Oh, that was uh, Serevna's really, really good, uh, really good weapon back in four. And obviously, it goes to the big boy. That is a pretty big upgrade. Hell yeah. I think it has an active too. Yep, it has an active. Cool. As long as this game typically? I don't know. Oh my. Carver just, oh my god, he does so much damage. Anything over here to the right? Oh, there's that pot right in front of my face. Oh! Okay. Alright. Sure. I'll take it. Kill the last demon king? No, not yet. Okay. The pots in an un er urn expected. What the fuck? Morphing jar? And it actually has mana for whack? Kill it. I hated these bastards in five. Kill them. absorbs 4 MP, you stop that. Oh my god, it's so tanky. Alright. Didn't get anything for him. Oh, he sucks. Alright. Oh. Okay. That is so strong. That's so, so strong. I like how just everybody's got active weapons that they're spamming. Active abilities. This is kind of funny. 
Hey? I know you, I know you, but Master Murder slung your souls into the dream world. You should have stayed there, you fools. Oh, okay. So I guess we'll just beat you up now. Hmm. It's kind of tanky. What the hell? Huh. Why so much health? Are you a mini boss? Get that thing out of here. Oh. Okay. 569 XP, Jesus. I mean, it was worth fighting him for that reason, I guess. I didn't see our statues anywhere, though. Maybe it's on the other side. God, we have so much bad AoE. We? Where? Hey. I'm ready for him this time. I got the fire claw. God, I hope that's going to be good enough. Now this guy makes me a little nervous. Four of them. Jeez. Evan. Really is liking that spam to spam swoosh, Tony. I'm not even at the boss yet, dude. She mm. really, really likes swoosh. Yeah, there's another door down here. Shit. It's another door and it looks like it leads to literally nothing, but... Alright. I could beat them up for the XP. Hmm. God, they're so well animated. Hey. So I guess their statues aren't down here. Maybe it'll be like a cutscene thing for these two. God. I love being asleep. Which is something I will probably be doing in just a bit after this stream. Uh, please. He's playing to sleep? Yeah, I know. Crazy thought, isn't it? You know, I've never burned a candle before. When do you get rid of the candle? Till it's empty? I've always wondered that. Like, does the candle empty? All right. Does it do that every day? No. No, I don't. I wish I did, though. Eat the candle? I'm, I'm being serious. <laughs> Well, it's a candle that you, um... Yeah, it's just a candle you put on a hot plate. Yeah, so, okay, so I can just... I can just plug it in once a day for, like, eight hours where it'll auto-shut off. And I just use it until the candle's literally gone. Okay. 
those scenty ones? Yeah! I can't smell it, but I thought it'd be, like, good for the air. Maybe, like, psychological stuff, you know what I mean? It's, uh, lilac. My one damage deal. My my big damage dealer being dead asleep fucking sucks. <laughs> Alright. More stats. Oh! There were stairs underneath him. There was a point coming back here. Holy shit. Door's locked. Door's locked. Was there a point of coming down here? Yeah, okay. Dun, 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 dun. Baking grease candle, that... That sounds... Your friend bought hot dog scented candles. That's pretty gross. Hmm. I'd be lying if I said you lied to the person, be fuck. What? Okay. Okay, well, guess who is, uh, not fighting? I can't use evac here. No, I have to- I have to walk out and use zoom! Ugh, it sucks! Oh. Gonna give the Samland demo a try? I did, actually! I did. I did earlier. Uh, it was a little choppy on my end, but I think that may have been because I accidentally left a YouTube video up in the background on the same mod or on full screen, so that might be the reason why, but I did play around with it, and I thought the vehicles actually handled, handled pretty damn nice. It's cool. It's cool. I like how, um, uh, I like how when you get inside a mech or get inside a motorcycle or something, your companions get inside, like, a buggy and follow you around. It's really fun. Oh, man. I just send the Loaf Dragon to coffee me Coffin meme now. <laughs> oh, God. Ugh. Oh. And you have a phone? What? Okay. Walk it back out of the damn castle. Holy hell, this place sucks. Oh, can I not leave? Because we... Oh. oh, are you serious? Oh, I can't leave, can I? Does zoom work here? Please tell me zoom works here. Oh my god. Are you real? Oh. Oh, this is a shame. Evac didn't work earlier either. Oh. Oh, oh this blows. There's a balcony or something anywhere, is there? Nope. Nope, there's no way to leave. When you zoom into here, you can't zoom out. And guess who's the only one who has the revive spell? Hey, you're right. It's the corpse. <laughs> well. Well, this was an unfortunate loss. Honestly, you should just let, just let them kick my ass. Because <laughs> there's literally nothing I can do. This fucking sucks. Oh my god. That sucks. Alright. That seems poorly designed. Maybe. <laughs> I just gotta pray to God they kill me. 
dum, dum, da, dum. Okay, maybe it might be easier if I just spam the attack button instead. And I'll just die eventually, I guess. Why oomph the slime? I don't know, but that was really funny. Oh man, hey, Seti Funny. Why, yes, a boy. Hello. Oh my. You better at least gain a level doing this. Ugh. Boom, 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 God. Ba -dum, da -dum. Now it's stuck inside my eye. Yay. Carver gained a level. Good for him. Good for him. At least you can consider this training unintentional, but yeah, I guess I could. Dragon Quest Boozlers. I'm just praying to I was just praying to God God takes me soon in this game. <laughs> oh man. Hey, the goddess. I'm almost dead. He realizes that Carver is now just going to be even higher level than me again. The hyperbolic time trailer. God. I wonder. Knuckle sandwich. He's getting so much soul XP, oh my god. Really cannot hit, huh? Oh man. No idea. Use the club. There we go. Now punch the slimes. Oh my god. Alright. Somehow I knew it'd always be Carver. Oh gee oh yeah, no, he's not living through that. Ah, that thing does like set damage, it's so much. Alright. I think now's a good time to save. And if I'm being honest, I think now's a good time to call it. <laughs> because... There's probably more after that boss. Even though he is... Even though I absolutely got my ass beat. And then had a very unfortunate section where my healer accidentally ate shit. I think, uh... I think now is a good time to call it. Because there's probably still a lot left. I'm only level 20. We finished the, like, when we finished the fifth game around, like, level 30-something. We still got time. Oh, good god. Ugh, oh, stretching my neck, cracking my bones. Oh, man. Rest really, Traveler, for you have been wrecked. I... 
I really did. Good God. No, I really did. I got my ass handed to me. Ugh. I got my ass handed to me. We'll try it again uh, next time. Time for resting and be at your best. Yeah! And I think it's a good time to call it overall. I'm still my entire first level dragon zone just by shooting seagulls. <laughs> nice. So I assume when you get the most gains. Yeah, that's probably true for uh, certain things. If you eat too much. And hey, if you're new here, I've got a fancy Twitter. Well, I got a Twitter. And I've got a fancy blue sky if you want to know the next time that I do go live. Which is every night unless I say otherwise. Oh, man. Also, hey, the weird deer, if you're still there, welcome to the Null Patrol and thank you for following. My alerts have been a little wonky today. We had another bot attack, funny enough. <laughs> but again, I, like... They don't show up on the stream at all, and it has no actual effect on the stream. So it's just kind of funny. I just gotta look at the list a little bit more. Rose having tons of bot issues tonight. I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. There's been, uh, there's been hate raids going on. Uh, I've noticed it twice. Uh, the This time, the previous time that I streamed. And it seems like the go for any viewer account, period, as well. Or they have set accounts they're going for. So it's, uh, it's... Oh boy. It's a mess. I'll just have to, uh, pass around information that I know that I usually do for anybody who's having any trouble, and I'll ask around and see how everyone's doing. Is it with a furry tag? Oh, I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised if that's the case. It's kind of funny, though. Oh, man, it's kind of funny, though, whenever this happens. Because when you have your, uh, when you have your bot stuff set up, it literally doesn't do anything to you at all. But what I'm, what I'm, like... What I'm, like, mildly... <laughs> is to press the right word. There was not a single offensive name in every single one of these bot names on this list. It's just all boring shit. Like... <laughs> uh, I just think it's funny. It's kind of funny in a sad way. Oh, it is. It's nice, it's nice to know that I'm productive with my free time. I don't know. It's, it's like, uh, it's like an enlightening thing. Like, hey, I'm doing something appropriate with my free time. This robot shit? Yeah, exactly. In fact, I am probably going to stuff my face and watch more free in because my heart, oh my god. Alright. So, I'm gonna grab some to raid. And again, sorry for not using the normal rig tonight. <laughs> I had such a bad migraine at the start, but I really didn't want to skip stream because I have a friend who's coming over on, like, the 20th, and I don't know if I'll stream that night. And I didn't want to take, like, you know, day off, day off, stream, day off, you know what I mean? So I wanted to, like, do something tonight. Oh, man. Uh, there actually are things uh, Twitch ha uh, does have to set up that you can under the moderator commands. There is stuff that you could use for uh, the anti-bot protection, but it is heavily recommended that you have... Uh, third-party stuff anyways, because it's always going to be better, because customization. Not right. Not right. What do you thought about Fern fighting? Oh! Oh, actually getting to see her fight? Really interesting, without spoiling. I wonder what that guy meant when he said that thing to her. I'm really curious about it, but you're a disgrace to mages. Like, I'm really, really curious, actually. Freehan's really good. Hey, yo, it's crazy about Freehan. Like, it does have its, like, very moody, almost depressing concept at the forefront all the time. But it still knows, like, how to be a really, really cool action show when it does. Which isn't that often, but when it happens... Oh my god, it's, it's not only well animated, it's really well written. And everything involving the demons was like some of the coolest shit. I loved it. I, I genuinely do. The way they use the word, like, why do you use that word? Because it stops you from killing us. Like, there's just a lot of shit in that whole arc I absolutely adore. It was really good. It was really good. I really loved that whole arc. Oh, man. Before I gush for an absolute year, though. Uh, let me grab somebody to raid. 
I'll send you all on their way. Nobody minds? Yeah? All right, all right, I'll take it, I'll take it. Okay. All right. Yeah, uh, I am going to set up a raid here for Ruman, who is currently doing uh, Lagrange Point, which I have never heard about, so I am painfully curious. But we shall go see. All right. All right. Intervene automatically? Uh, well, there's no real way of intervening automatically without having something set up ahead of time. Uh, the best thing you do with Twitch is uh, there's like a shield mode thing you can use, and there's also, there are security settings you can actually enable. Uh, for instance, there's one you can enable where if the user has not set up a, uh, like confirm their email, then they will not be able to chat. And you can have it set for like X period of days since account creation started. So you can have it be like, oh, they can't talk here unless their accounts existed for more than three days, kind of thing. Which is good, because bots are generally created like on the spot like that kind of thing. Raid message? Yeah, sure, why not? Will that, will that show up for them? It's BTTV. Oh well. Hey, I hope you all have a good day. I hope you all have a fantastic night. I will see you all later. Not sure what we're doing tonight, but it's definitely going to be something spooky. But, y'all be good. Take care. Stay out of trouble. Don't do anything horrendous, and... Make sure you have mana for the evac spell when you enter a place you're not sure you're going to have to walk back out of.